All right. Hopefully, everything is working. Working fine. I hope so. If not, I will cry. And I will give up. All right. Oh, shit. I might have to restart Matt's effect. Hold up. If I click on this, will it cancel out my controller inputs? Mass Effect is pretty weird like that. It does that shit sometimes. Sometimes Mass Effect. There we go. Sometimes it doesn't know what the fuck it wants. You just gotta... You just gotta tell it what it wants. 50 no's and one yes means yes. <laughs> let's not joke about that. Let's not. Let's not have dark jokes at the beginning. <laughs> make people feel some sort of way all right let me just make sure that i don't have any of my uh other monitors sounds on because i want to hear everything through my headset excuse me i spent like two hours today making pasta making the pasta I want it, I want it like, I bought like some gorgonzola and shit, and I was like, man, I really like gorgonzola. It's a good cheese, good funky blue cheese, I love it, All right? It's got a nice tartness to it, I like it. Great flavor profile, but it tastes good with some spaghetti, so I was like, I want some spaghetti, right? So I went and I started making some spaghetti, but I was like, you know what, instead of just doing noodle, sauce, whatever, stupid, like meatball or chopped meat that you're gonna throw in there, I was like, fuck it. Let's get some peppers in there. Let's get some mushrooms in there. Let's get some zucchini in there. Let's have two different types of meat in there. I spent like two hours making it, right? And I said, fuck, I don't want no regular tomato sauce. Let's make some vodka sauce. I did that too. Did all of it. You know, fucking tasted great. Amazing. Spent two hours making it. I go to sleep after I ate some. I get up. Walk out of my room. I made I made a big pot for everybody to eat today. And then as I get out of my room and I walk towards the kit, kitchen, I'm thinking like I might get some more spaghetti, right? And right next to the pot of full spaghetti, I see a plate of chicken nuggets that someone has just freshly made. And I was like, well, quote unquote, made. They uh. They fry their chicken nuggets for some reason. I don't do that. I put mine in the oven. But, um, either that or if you're too lazy, you throw it in the microwave, right? They did that. And I was like, and I just looked at it for like a good minute. And I was like, so my two hours of cooking wasn't, wasn't, it wasn't enough for you. I made, I made a big helping for everybody. And you people complain that I don't cook enough in this house for you people. I say I like my cooking. Yeah, ask me to cook, but then you do shit like this. I was really upset. I'm not gonna lie. I was like, "Oh, so it wasn't enough for you?" Okay, all right, cool. Okay, all right, all right, great. Nice to know that I that I fucking sat in a hot ass kitchen for fucking two hours. Not just a hot kitchen, but like the summer hot kitchen, like super heat. Because for some reason, these people in my house are fucking whack jobs. And they're like, yeah, man, turn off the AC and just let it get hot and swampy and muggy around here. Every time I walk out my room, it's a fucking sauna out there and I don't get it. I don't get it, right? But nah, man, my spaghetti wasn't enough. You had to make chicken nuggets. I'm sorry, the two options of, of lean turkey meat and fatty sausage that was in there wasn't, that wasn't enough protein for you and your spaghetti. You had to make some chicken nuggets. All right, all right, no, 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 I see, I see how it is, right? Anyways, <laughs> welcome back to more Mass Effect. My intro, what's my intro again? Uh, Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, man, machine, everything in between. Hello, bots, how are you doing today? Nice to know that you'll never leave me. At least I know I'm talking to something that exists, <laughs> right? Um, welcome back to more Mass Effect 1. I believe, Tally, what the fuck are you doing over there? You're supposed to be eyeing up those guys. You're supposed to be eyeing up me for Mass Effect 2. What you doing? See, Garrus, he's by my side. This is Uncle Garrus. I love him. I love him as he loves me. Anyways, welcome back to Mass Effect 1. 
what we did last time we did uh we did both um no i was about to say we did both ilos we're heading to ilos that's where we're going um we did uh novaria and we also did vermeyer and i think we might have did like a little bit of side questing on the side i'm not sure i think we did right i believe we did but um oh yeah, yeah, yeah uh did we clean up the stuff we need to do in citadel we did a little bit of cleanup um at the end of the last part i believe i said uh once you get in the citadel over here you can uh head back to normandy and just and just finish some stuff off before you go talk to anderson and flux i i guess i must have been tired or some shit because i think after that stream i fucking like went to sleep and i woke up and i was like did i say something stupid last night right <laughs> so what i actually meant to say was uh Vermeyer, it's not the point of no return, but Vermeyer is usually something people would say for last because once you do it, they're gonna sing you over to the Citadel. And basically, what happens is that they lock you down here in the Citadel until you go talk to Anderson, and then you basically steal the Normandy because now it's under, um, it's under Citadel jurisdiction or whatever the fuck, right? So once you steal the Normandy, you will not be able to head back to the Citadel until after you finish Ilos. And I believe once you finish Ilos and you come back to the Citadel, I believe that's the end of the game. Basically, that's like the final hoorah you're going to do, right? So this is your last time to wrap up anything you really have on the Citadel. But I recommend that you uh, highly recommend that before going to Vermeer and doing all that stuff, you pretty much do everything you want to do. But that said, uh, I don't think depending on how long we go for this session um because since i can't leave right now i can't leave the citadel without uh activating you know without locking myself out of the citadel um that means i wasn't able to go and grab the shit from the other planets that i wanted to right so uh retrieve the package oh shit where the fuck was I supposed to bring that package to? Oh, I didn't even pick it up. I think I just, like, went to the Normandy. Oh, fuck, I forgot. That's back on Novaria. Damn. Uh, this is the mission. They want us to head to Ilos. And there's still some, like, little side quest stuff out there. Once you get out, ha uh, once you, uh, leave the Citadel this time around, Hackett will still contact you to do, like, you know, other side missions that you can do while you're still in space. So those aren't locked out, but anything that requires you to return to the Citadel or even be at the Citadel, um, you know, it'll be locked out. So what we're going to do, because I feel I feel like there's probably maybe one or two missions that I might need to come back to the Citadel for. But if we uh, if we miss it, then so be it, I guess. So what we're going to do is we're just going to do ourselves a nice quick, a nice quick like, uh, like uh, what you call it, a nice quick like. Just journey through the area. Uh, just avoid flux, basically. That's what we're going to do. We're just going to run around, talk to whoever needs to be talked to, grab whatever licenses Hello. need to be grabbed. And, um... Show me what you've got. And basically, you know, just do a, do a cleanup on the Citadel. Do what we can do. Right? Now, I do not know what the best items are. Oh, shit. I'm at max money. Fuck. <laughs> Damn it. I do not know what the best uh, guns are, but I do know what the best armor is, and basically it's anything. It's all Colossal armor. I think it's going to be like Colossal 10 or something. Uh, I'm going to grab these licenses. Now, let me see. I think that's everything I can grab from him. I'm just going to grab all the licenses that I can grab, and then, uh, you know. We're going to run around, see if there's any character that needs to talk to us, because sometimes, sometimes they don't put the icons on the map. Other times they do put the icons on the map. Sometimes the icons are on the map, but they refuse to take them away. Mass Effect 1 is really stupid like that. It's not the mods. I wish that the community patch kind of fixed that up, but it really doesn't. Maybe it's something that they just couldn't do. But, um, it's kind of annoying, I'm not going to lie. Because sometimes when I'm, like, running back to other other planets and shit you, I'm like did I do what I was supposed to do here like for example uh, when I completely just missed out on stream like I completely just walked past the room where you get the geth information for tally all, you've cleared the red line you may initialize a grab and charge your FTL drive 
okay shut up <laughs> when um yeah i just like walked past it because i thought the mission was over because you know you had the little text flip that's like blah 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 mission over geth satellite whatever cool all right and then you move on but like the but the plot fucking icon is still there and i'm sitting there i'm like wait a minute uh this leads to the presidium and presidium leads to Da, 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 da. Okay, I'm just a doing a little bit of mapping in my head. Um, been destroyed. The exact cause is currently unknown. Given the research okay. conducted on Novaria, many are blaming the destruction I love of the weird, uh, Not wrong. weird, but I love the elevator music they got here. It's just so. Currently faces criminal charges it's a bit too casual for space. You know what I mean? It's space casual. Unclear. Anyways, uh, what the fuck was I saying? Oh yeah, so. Basically, I just missed a room. Good thing that I did a little cleanup sweep around of the planets and shit that we can visit. But, um... Uh, I missed a room where there's, like, a terminal and you just get the information that Tally wants for the Geth. And, like, that's something that carries over to Mass Effect 2. It's not too crazy if you get it or not. Mo like, most of the stuff in Mass Effect 1 that carry over to Mass Effect 2 aren't too crazy. And, like, if any of this shit carries over to Mass Effect 3, it's usually just going to be put into war assets or maybe, like, a throwaway dialogue line here or there, right? Mass Effect 2 is already fucking just so they finally did it. completely, I knew you know, kind would make bonkers with, with a bunch of dialogue and shit. You're better than the one they're sending you after. Hmm. I'll do whatever it takes to stop Sarah. Hmm. That's what worries me. Was there something you wanted? Nah, man. I'll be going now. Goodbye, Commander. I didn't talk to this dude after I became a Spectre. Can't believe that. This is definitely a part of the part of the fucking playthrough where unlimited sprint comes in super handy because we can just run around. You got anything for me, bartender? Hello, Commander. Can I get you something? Commander. Do you know who I am? Did I not talk to him already? There's a I could fill you. I so thought long, I did. Commander. Have a pleasant day. I know I scanned all these guys. Hey, Telly, what's up? This place seems strange. I wish there were more humans around. I haven't talked to that diplomat at all. I thought he was there for like a mission or something, but I guess he's just there for like background dialogue or some shit. Yeah, but um, you go and you fucking grab the uh, you grab the fucking Geth ship, uh, the Geth data or whatever you hand it to Tally. She's like, "Thanks, Shepard. I will never talk to you again. <laughs> Not until Mass Effect 2. All right, smartass Volus. Let's see what the fuck. There's another one in here. The Earth Clan Specter has returned to speak with me. Did you change your suit? Did he have a different suit while we was here before? Did I? Oh wait, no. I think it might be the fucking uh the diversity mod that changed his suit. Huh? Was it always like this? Yeah, anything new for me? Let me see. Why are you so cranky? You seem to have a bit of a chip on your shoulder, Din. You humans are new to the oh. Citadel. Okay. Deep. All right, nothing changed here. Yes, yes. Good day, Earth Clan. This room used to be empty. <laughs> There's a lot of fucking bolus in there. But I mean, I got it's their ambassador. Am ambassador? And embassy? That's the word. Ambassador. What the fuck? Oh wait, actually, can I speak to Udina? Is he like in his office, or is he just fucking around with the council right now? Guess he's fucking around with the council. Huh. Alright, that's cool. What's up, Phoenix? How you doing? Hope you're having a lovely- What the fuck? What are you getting stuck on? Really? Really, Shepard? Really? Really, Chad? What you doing? Why you doing that? Stop it. Get some help. Because McDonald and me want you to be the best person that you can. <laughs> oh wait I think the community patch fucking comes in with the shut the fuck up Avina mod <laughs> so instead of every time we walk past her she goes hello dude I remember just looking through the nexus and what the fuck you okay back there my dog just started like flipping around the bed like he's crazy I think he's turning is it a full moon tonight? He's a hellhound. He's little, he's he's very tiny. He's a tiny dog. But he's a hellhound though. 
when the full moon comes out, he fucking transforms. Fire starts spitting out of his fucking mouth. I want you two to kiss. <laughs> I forgot what the fuck I was saying. I was saying something. Oh yeah, I was looking at the Nexus mod shit. And wait, where where's this lead to? The wards? I don't want to go there yet. Looking at the Nexus mod shit, and when you just like scroll through or whatever, you know, you got you get you know you get your your classic fucking you know shepherd dick out mod, right? Dick out for Harambe mod and all this shit. But then I'm just scrolling through, and I just see like the shut the fuck up Avina mod, and I'm like, w was it really that bad? But then again, you know, most people were like, regret leaving Citadel security to pursue Saren, Garrus? Fighting a rogue specter with countless lives at stake and no regulations to get in the way? I'd say that beats CSEC. I'm pleased that the imminent destruction of all organic life has improved your career opportunities. What the hell, Tully? <laughs> You're the one who asked them the question. He's like, I'm happy that you're getting paid more. I'm like, what the fuck? Tally, you asked him the question. What? What? <laughs> Mass Effect 1, the memories despite that you haven't finished it. Oh, don't I don't think we'll finish it tonight. We'll probably finish it by like next next stream. Torian Diplomat. I know that Torian doesn't have any. Actually, you know what? That's a lie. <laughs> I was going to say they might not have a mission for me, but there's a chance that they, Humans in the that they do. Because I know they changed some of the NPCs around here. Uh, by the way, this is the modded version. I just want to, I just want to point out, <laughs> uh, I modded the shit out of this. So this hairstyle and can I, can I show your beautiful face, Shepard? Let me put my gun away. How do I do that again? I don't know. I'm too dangerous. There we go. Like Shepard's face and, you know, our Chad Shepard here. Our Chad Wellington Shepard. What the fuck? What? Garris, what you doing? <laughs> okay. You just gonna let her rip up on you like that ain't gonna say nothing all right but um yeah part of the part of some of the mods is the diversity mod that's in here so like the female torians and i think there might be female um i know there's definitely a few corians around here right which is great for mass effect one because they really don't get out that much and um there's some face cleanup mods that i did so Oh, by the way, we killed, uh, we killed Kaiden. He's dead. Bye. <laughs> he survives too long. He survives in too many different universes. We must equal it out. Actually, I'm, uh, this is my first time I ever killed off Kaiden. Kaiden, wherever the fuck you say his name. And for Mass Effect 1, I'm going to romance Ashley because everyone romances Liara. And I think, you know what? I'm like, you know what? If not, I've Maybe got Ashley needs some love, okay? Of. Her and her beautiful lazy eye. I have to go, Admiral. Commander. She got that lazy eye going. They didn't fix that with the fucking mods. She still gives you that like, kind of like half open eyed look. But I told uh, I told her Ash to stay on the ship. Cause we almost we almost kissed, but you know Joker's an asshole, so whatever. So right now I'm just gonna do a, a quick run around the citadel before we uh. Also the fucking textures. Oh my god. Every time I walk through this hallway, I keep forgetting how much the texture mod improved this fucking area. Holy shit, just look at it. God damn. That lighting is so good. <laughs> and it's even better in the Mass Effect 2 community mods. Oh my god. But we must wait. We must wait for yes, Mass Effect 2. If you do not mind me asking, how do you feel about hunting a Torian? Didn't you just ask him that? Saren is either a traitor or a madman. Taking him down will restore the good name of Turians everywhere. Things are different among my people. So you basically just asked him the same question, Tally. To be loyal, you just said it differently. It You're lucky you got those fucking Chun Li thunder thighs. Oh my god. I love you so much, Tally. But I have to hide it until Mass Effect 2. But then Jack is going to show up and I'm going to be like, what? My penis is confused. I don't know what to do. <laughs> First time I played Mass Effect 2, my penis was confused. <laughs> I was like, huh? I was like, she has no hair, but why am I attracted to her? She's cool. And then I got older, and I was like, you know what? Shaved women? Pretty hot. Who are you to tell me what my husband would want? Are you guys okay over here? I'm the only person making sense right now. You're endangering your baby. This baby is the only thing I have left of Jake. 
Wait, what? What are you guys doing? I don't care what you think, Michael. It's my decision. I know you're hurting, Rebecca, but don't let your grief hurt your baby, too. What the fuck is wrong with you guys? Can I help you with anything? Perhaps you could talk some sense into her. I don't need anyone to talk sense into me, Michael. I'm not undergoing the treatments. My sister-in-law here is pregnant, and she's refused to let the baby undergo gene therapy in utero. Okay, what, what's the what's the problem? Does she have like a disease or something? What? What? Yeah, that's that's your story. Never mind. I'm certain that she has a good reason. I'd like to hear both. Yeah, sides. I want to hear both sides. What the fuck's going My on here? My husband Jacob died from a rare heart condition several months ago. There's a chance that the baby could develop the same heart condition, but routine gene therapy can eliminate it. A very small chance, Michael. And extranet reports say the therapy could harm the child. It's less dangerous than the genetic enhancements that every soldier in the Alliance receives. Hmm. What to do, what to do. Let's invest the Gassianas. What's the chance of the diseases? What are the chances that your child will develop the heart condition? What's the chance of your child being a fucking a mutant? Chance, and if chance of them being a Morlock living in the sewers? Medical treatments are available. Which are nowhere near as effective as simply getting the gene therapy. True, that does sound true. You ain't gotta yell at her about it though, you can talk like a normal person. What's the dangers what of the therapy? What are the chances the gene therapy could hurt the baby? One in 300 at most. But extranet articles say there could still be long-term complications we don't know about. Don't you understand? If my baby is that one in 300, I will always wonder if I... If, if I killed my baby for nothing. Listen, it's not my... I am a firm believer that it would not be my choice. At the end of the day, right? Regardless of my position. Look at that homeboy walking in the background. I love him. Anyways. Right? I don't know how new... Actually, I do. They said what? It's been like 26 years since the since humans been on the Citadel. So I'm assuming all this gene therapy shit is like relatively new to humans, right? One in 300. That's that's a really high risk when you, when you're talking about human birth rates. That's a really high risk. I wouldn't say get the treatment. I wouldn't say get the treatment. It's too much of a risk. It's too much of a risk. One in three hundred, I think, is a higher risk than the chance of the baby getting getting the disease. Hmm. I don't know. It's you... Rebecca's child, Michael. It's her baby, dude. I think you should honor her decision. Damn it! She's not choosing. She's acting blindly out of grief. You know, causing stress during the pregnancy definitely ain't helping, homeboy. Of course she is. So are you. Yelling at her won't bring your brother back. How dare you? I'm trying to do what's best for the baby. Then support the baby's mother. Stand with her when she makes tough decisions. This baby is the only thing my brother... It's all I have left of him. How is his hair like slicked to the to side and to the back at the same the time? Safe. He's got a really weird it's hairstyle. All I have left too, Michael. I just want Jacob's child to be safe. I want to give him that much. We will. I promise. Thank you for talking with us. And then he I pushes her down the steps. <laughs> That's terrible. Renegade! Yeah, Renegade Shepherd. Look how majestic he is. So beautiful. That's a beautiful creature. Where's this lead? Oh, this is the broker. The information broker. Um, uh, where the hell? <laughs> Double murder? <laughs> eh, she can survive the fall. Baby might not. Unless she had twins, you know? You don't know. Homeboy's brother could have been very fertile. Look at that fucking whale tail going on. Jesus. <laughs> fucking Christ. I'm sorry, Tally, you got something to say? The Krogan rebelled against the Council, yet they have a statue on the Citadel. And we Quarians still live as outcasts. 
Because you guys don't want to be part of the Citadel. What are you talking about? What? You choose to be out. Okay. Shut the fuck up, Tally. I love you, but you say some real stupid shit sometimes. <laughs> Damn it, I love your stupidity. I love you so much. I love you. Let's be honest, I think Tally might be the most racist out of all of us here. I mean, Ashley says some crazy shit, but like... Tally's like, shoot the geth on sight. Like, I understand. But at the same time, I wanted to see, uh... Okay, can't go back there. I missed my chance to get whatever medallion she hands to us, which I don't know what a, what effects it has. Maybe something in Mass Effect 2? I don't know. Hello again. The consort is very pleased with everything that you have done for her. I think I'm done here. Of course. Come back anytime. I think I'm done here. Sure, get the fuck out. Alright. I think that's it for our little trip around the Presidian. Doesn't seem like anyone has any uh, quest for us besides that little side banter we just had, so uh, head over to this terminal. And then we're gonna head down to the wards. Not Flux though. We're gonna be avoiding Flux. We're gonna head down to uh, the markets. I need to see if I have uh... Oh shit, I should have spoke to the Hanar, see if he had any licenses for me. I'll go back there. I'll make sure to go back there. Welcome back, Earth Clan. Will you be needing supplies for your return to the colonies? Show me what you've got. Most excellent. I am sure you will find something pleasing. The evil swabble, but they don't punish your ex. Holy shit, I think that might be one of the better weapons. What is this, a sniper rifle? Anything with X is basically pretty good. It's grade 10, so... I'm gonna buy those since I got a shit ton of money. But I still gotta save it for the, uh... For the armor. If I can get my hands on that. Moreland! Many good supplies, yes? Hello there! Welcome to Moreland's famous shop. You want many good supplies, yes? Many good supplies, yes. <laughs> Let me see what you have. Despite that, her kind created the oh, geth. The, <laughs> the war. <laughs> the war always changed to the beginning. Dude, uh, you look back to the, um... It's a bit of a spoiler. But, I mean, like, the they sow the seeds in here, kind of. And, um... In, like, the, the lore or whatever for the Quarians. Fucking, like, the geth... Like, they start getting, like, consciousness, like, actual thoughts, and they start questioning, like, what's my purpose, what am I here for, and shit, right? And then, without even, like, thinking, like, first of all, AI's super illegal, right? So they been fucking went over that. They been already, you know, the fact that the Geth exists are illegal in the first place, but, um, fucking... <laughs> Without even, like, trying to have peace talks, they just go, oh shit, kill it, kill it, kill it, right? And I mean, eh, we understand, right? But at no point were the Geth, like, time to kill, time to kill life. Like, they just went, kill it. And then fucking, there were, uh, quote-unquote Geth sympathizers. Basically, people who had some damn sense that were like, guys, maybe we should calm down and see what's going on here. And then the Quarians start killing those people off, too. So anyone that was like, okay, let's hear the Geth out, though, they just start, like, they had their own little civil war to the point where they just basically killed off everyone who supported the Geth in any type of way. And then they just said, time to kill the fucking Geth. And it's like, wow, Quarians, you're really crazy. So then the Geth defended themselves, kicked them, kicked the shit out of them, kicked them off the homeworld. And they're like, I don't believe, basically, it's the fucking, <laughs> it's the surprise Pikachu face meme. It's fucking like, it's like, why would you do that? <laughs> like the fucking, basically, the Geth shoot in defense, and then the Quarians go, why would you do that? Surprise Pikachu face. I didn't do anything wrong to you. I got business here, but not with you. It's probably some uh, side quest or something that I skipped out on with that guy. I, I don't know. I forgot, I forgot what his purpose there is for. He's there for a reason, for something. It's really stupid. And then, like, you talk to Tally, who, uh, is the only 
In Mass yeah. Effect 1, she's the only Except Quarian you meet, they make right? The only Quarian in the game in Mass Effect 1 because they're supposed to play, play a bigger deal in Mass Effect 2, which, you know, also deals with the Reapers because the Geth look up to the Reapers and then all this other shit that will happen in Mass Effect 2 that has ramifications for 3 and stuff like that. And, like, the Geth and the Quarian play a major role with that connected to the Reapers and all that shit, right? And, by the way, here's one of the Quarians just all huddled up. This is because of the mod. And it's like, when your only insight on an, on an entire race is one character in the first game, and they're going like, Yeah, nah, we're the good guys, though. We ain't never fucked up. We ain't never did nothing. And that character was grown up in a fucking, um... In an environment just surrounded by, like, super, super racist. <laughs> I'm saying racist, but, you know, I, I technically, they're... They're inorganic life, so I guess they're a race, right? But, like, basically, when you're grown up being told these horror stories that the Geth are fucking evil, don't trust the Geth, they will kill you, so shoot on sight. Fucking Tally's just pretty much growing up fucking echoing what she heard. And she's like, yeah, nah, they're super bad. And it's like, you sure about that, Tally? She's like, nah, 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 nah I'm sure. My, my Adults wouldn't lie to me, would they? Like, of course they would. Did I hit? I did hit the cores den. Okay, and this leads to where? This is. This leads to the wards, right? To CSEC Academy. This goes directly to CSEC? Does this go directly to CSEC or to the ward then CSEC? Because I want to head to the. I want to head to, like, the hallway the wards like the wards little hallway area check that out see if there's anything there for me if not then i'm just gonna head over to the uh does this lead to the wards this leads to the presidium what the fuck Presid oh but i think it leads Your choice to the presidium through the war limited, Tally. couldn't you wear something without a helmet no, living in the clean environment of the flotilla has weakened. No, I'm super the immunodeficient. Suits protect against diseases. So your people are forever wandering, and now they couldn't settle if they wanted to. I'm sorry. Tally goes so far as in Max Effect 2 to just be like, I'll make myself sick just to get with you, Shepard. Canonically. Tally's dripping right now. <laughs> Mass Effect 2, she literally sits down and talks. She's like, she's like, Shepard, Liara and Ashley were like really close to you, but I wanted to get at that so bad. <laughs> I'm like, wow, calm down. You flatter me so. In a further development in the Eden Prime investigation, the council has reportedly revoked the Spectre staff. Actually. Of its operatives. While the unnamed operative is not yet kind of a kind of kind of man, kind of a slight ma major kind of slight team. major spoiler a little bit uh not all geth think that everyone is bad not every geth thinks that there's actually a lot of geth that thinks that there's still a possibility and i'm gonna try and see if i can mod mass effect 2 when we get to it um, to, uh, to make it so that, slight spoilers, there's a, there's a Geth party member you get in Mass Effect 2, but you get him, like, near the end of the game, so, like, there's no chance, in, like, the vanilla version of the game, there would be, like, no chance to actually fucking hear any of the optional dialogue he would have if, uh, he, my bad, they would have if they go on a mission with you, um, because once you get them, they're tied to story progression, so once you unlock that party member, you have like two more missions that you can do before it just thrusts you to the end of the game. So I'm going to see if I can mod it out. Oh, Legion. Okay, there we go. Um, I'm going to see if I can mod it out to make it so that that doesn't, uh, that getting Legion to our party doesn't affect that. Um, I'm not sure. I'm, I'm pretty sure someone has a mod for it somewhere. I hope so. Right? Because I really want to just show off a lot of optional things for, uh, for Legion. And Legion gives a lot of insight into things as to uh, how the Geth perceives shit. Because Legion shows up and he goes like, Yo, 
Yeah, so like, not all the Geth are bad. We don't all hate you. It's just that though get the Geth you've been fucking with in Mass Effect One, they're bad. Those guys are like heretics. They're the bad one. They're the they're waving the Confederate flag over there, saying fucking make the make the veil great again. All right, let me let me not use that as an example. Well, Confederacy, I'll, I'll use that as an example, but I won't I won't attack Republicans like that. You're free to your choices. <laughs> You're free to your choices. Not every Republican's a bad person. All right. We can we can all be civil about it. Where what the fuck am I doing on the person name again? Oh yeah, the Hanar. Fuck. <laughs> He's uh over in the uh financial district. This is why I came back over here. Watch Mass Effect walk through see so you now a few things. Alright. Mass Effect is very vast. It, it's a lot. Like, I played a lot of Mass Effect, and I still don't remember fucking everything. Commander, it is good to see you again. Would you care to see some of its fantastic items today? Would you care to see my squishy boinga boingas? I would like to buy some. Tell me your items. Oh, this one is pleased to do so, human. <laughs> I love the hand art. Not be disappointed. Oh, this one's pleased. View upgrade standard items. Oh, shit. I should have go talk to the lady at the medical bay. Raptor and Stinger. Oh man, this is taking a lot of money. Yikes. Eight skis. Let me see what upgrades you got. Commander. Show me your items. Oh, this one is pleased to do so, human. You will not be disappointed. I should also be looking at non human armors as well. Weapon upgrade. What the fuck? Uh, alright. Alright, eh, nothing too crazy. Commander. Show me your items. Oh, this one is pleased. What we got? Scorpion, Explorer, Explorer, Phoenix. Alright, nothing. Um, shit, I should have... I'm gonna head back over to fucking the markets real quick. Talk to the... Talk to the doctor there. See if she has any licenses for... Oh, fuck, damn it. There's also the dude in c -Sec. Damn it. Because I forgot to check the... The non-human items. You gotta check that shit, too. <laughs> Most Republicans are bad people. It depends. It depends. I don't like to... Welcome back, I don't like to see class. things in, like, a black and white type of way. To the but at the end of the day, I really don't give a fuck what anybody is, honestly. I, I don't care. They're not putting a gun to my head. I'm pretty, I'm pretty cool with it. Whichever way you're rocking. Did you have, a? Non-human items? Show me what you've got. Okay, no, you just have like standard shit. Alright, cool. Here's a grenade upgrade though. I don't know why I'm grabbing it. I barely use let me stop spending my money on fucking grenade upgrades. I barely use the damn thing. Morlin, my favorite! Many good supplies. Yeah, I think he's in Mass Effect too. <laughs> I think Morlin's in Mass Effect too. Many good supplies, yes? Hello there. Welcome to Morland's famous shop. You want many good supplies, yes? Many guys have lies. Let me see what you have. I don't know why I love his voice well, line so will much. Be pleased, I think. Very good things. You I will have. be pleased, I think. Non-human armors, please. Ah. Oh. Oh, it's medium armor though. Damn it. I want a heavy armor? It is Colossus though. How much are you asking for that? Oh my god, that's a lot. Holy shit. Holy fuck. Ah, just in case we don't run into it. Alright. Just in case we don't run into it anymore. Yeah. Because uh, getting the, the highest... I think the highest rarity armor is the uh, Heavy Krogan armor for the Colossus. I think that's the highest rarity for armor. So the fact that we just got medium or whatever, that's pretty good in general. Uh, Head to the doctor... Money's easy to come by. It is easy to come by, but sometimes when you're just doing like a bunch of missions and shit, you reach that limit without without realizing it. Also, I don't want to spend too long going on a shopping spree because I know sometimes people don't like watching it, right? Usually I try to keep that uh 
I need those supplies for my clinic. Oh, what the I fuck's can't. going on here? You can and you will, or your story won't stay secret for long. Don't disappoint me, Doctor. Oh, Commander Shepard, I didn't see you come in. You're in trouble again? Didn't I tell you to stop with this blackmailing shit? Every time I come in here, I see someone threatening you. Who was that? Someone from my past. I can take care of it. Sorry, I'm drinking some uh, Diet Coke. Just tell me what's going on. I was fired by my previous employer for giving out free medical supplies so, to clinics. So, I don't know if she has this accent in the original version of the game, because I don't really remember. I think they changed her voice in the community patch, in the mods. Now they are blackmailing. Because I don't remember her having such a I thick have accent. To give them what they want. If the board finds out about my past, I could lose my license. They'll shut my clinic down. Ain't my problem. All right, I'll help you. Sure, why Maybe not? Maybe I can get you out of this. You gonna pay me? Tell me what they want. You give me something. I have to give some of my medical supplies to a merchant in the markets. They expect delivery today. All right, I'll help you. Give me your contact's name. I'll deal with this guy, whoever he is. Deal with him. But won't they expose my past? <laughs> Not when I'm done with they them. They won't bother you again. I guarantee it. Garrus, shoot on sight. it's better if I don't know anymore. I was told to speak with a merchant named Morlan down in the market. Oh. I really appreciate this, Commander. Thank you. I can't be hurting my boy Morlan, though. He has many good supplies, yes? Let me take a look at what you have for sale. Of course. All right, what do you got? Exoskeleton bullshit. 3.5 health regen. Oh shit. That'd be great for fucking uh mental stimulant. Oh yeah, this was for the side quest. I, I gave the guy the depressant instead. Hmm. That'd be great for fucking racks. I'm giving it to Rex. I should use it for myself, but having Rex just like sitting there eating bullets and just going, mmm, yes, they heal me. I love it. It's great. All right, I'm not gonna blast Morlin in the face. Maybe I can press him for some info. Morlin, you're one of my favorites. What? I'm just gonna back up real quick. Don't look at me. Fuck you, nodding your head for. I had to stop and look at these two because I think the diversity patch put these two in here, but they look exactly, I think they literally are the exact same people in Mass Effect 2. Where like, uh, there's like, you know, this Asari chick fucking sitting there wondering if she should, uh, hang out with her Krogan boyfriend or not. Orlin, don't tell me you're a bad guy. I thought you were in the second game. Hello there. Welcome to Morland's famous shop. You want many good supplies, yes? You were expecting a delivery of medical supplies? But I was told the doctor would be bringing them. Things have changed, Morland. A change, but the doctor... I don't... This is not right, human. Shut up, Morland. I told Baines you'd screw this up. What the hell's going on here? Who are you? I'm your worst nightmare. Leave the doctor alone, or you'll have to deal with me. We can end this if you just bring me those supplies. Otherwise, I'll start telling people about the doctor's little secret. Talking your fucking dead? Her secret stays buried, or I bury you. Hey, hold on. I'm just the middleman here. He said, I won't die. This is way more than I bargained for. <laughs> he said, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. You win. Thank you, human. It is good to see him humbled so. Who the hell's Bane? What do you know about Bane? I have never met him, human. I only worked with the one who spoke with the doctor. That's all you can tell me? What do you know about Bane? I have never met him, human. I only worked with all the right. one who spoke with the doctor. Goodbye. Yes, all right then. Good tidings to you, human. Good tidings to you, human. Can I not find Bane? Okay. Hmm. If I have to like leave the citadel and come back, then I'm then we're never gonna find Bane. Because once I leave the citadel, we're gonna be fucking locked out of here.
Hello, I am here. It's done, Doctor. Commander, how did things go? Scared them all. He won't be bothering you anymore. Really? That's a great relief, Commander. Thank you. I can't pay you for your help, but I can give you a discount on any supplies you purchase here. Who the fuck's Bane? The thug said he worked for a man named Baines. Sound familiar? Baines? I wonder if he means Armiston Baines. We worked together a long time ago. What can you tell me about him? Last I heard, the Alliance military was contracting him for some research in the Traverse. We should follow up with Captain Anderson. Oh, okay. I don't think we'll be able to do that, but, uh... Sure. We'll see what the captain can tell us. I wish I could tell you more. Is there anything else I can help you with, Commander? I'll I'm good. You don't have any supplies for me. Um, and then we just gotta head over to C-Sec. Head over to C-Sec. Uh, fucking... Okay. Alright, homeboy was just like, wake humping the fucking car. Head over to C-Sec. Then we'll head over to, uh, Flux. And get the fuck out of here. Alrighty. Uh, where the fuck is the dude? He's downstairs, right? I think he's downstairs. What's up, dude, bro? Hello, Commander. Show me what you've got. I'll open the rare stocks for you, Commander. Enjoy. I will enjoy, thank you. Oh, I didn't even, like, check any of these. Oh, shit. I'm not gonna grab the grenade upgrade. We should be buying some biohack shit, but we don't really need it that much. Alright, cool. Let's head over to Flux. Over to Flux, talk to Anderson. Have him kill Udina. Have <laughs> him shoot him in the face. Be like, I'm gonna show you what I did to Rex on Vermeer. Uh, what location? Flux. Captain Anderson, it's been a long time since I've seen your beautiful face. Thanks to mods, we were able to afford that plastic surgery you oh so much needed. I'm glad you came, sir. I heard what happened. Alright. The Normandy's been grounded. I know, I'm sorry. I wanted to warn you, but there was no way to get a message to you before you docked. I know you're pissed off right now, but you can't give up. They all think this is over, but we both know it's not. You have to go to Ilos. You have to stop Saren from using the conduit. There's only one ship that can get me into the Terminus systems undetected, and she's grounded. Citadel <coughs> controls locked out all the Normandy's systems, but if we override the Ambassador's orders, we can get them to bring the Normandy back online. You can be in the Terminus systems before anyone even knows you're gone. And what happened to you? If we steal the Normandy, you're the one left holding the bag. And if Saren finds the conduit, life as we know it is over. The Reapers will destroy us. Humans, Asari, everybody. You're the only one who can stop him, Shepard. So I'll do whatever it takes to get you on the Normandy and off this station. What about my crew, though? Stealing the Normandy is mutiny. What if the crew won't help me? The Normandy's your ship now, Commander. Her crew will follow you to the ends of the galaxy. We both know that. You're right. What's the plan? I can unlock the Normandy from one of the consoles in the Citadel control center. You'll have a few minutes before anyone realizes what happened. Can you shoot That's Udina while you do it? That's area patrolled by armed guards. How are you going to get in? Leave that to me. Just make sure you're in the Normandy when the systems come back online. There's got to be a better way. Ambassador Udina issued the lockdown order. If I can hack into the computer in his office, maybe I can override it. He won't just stand by while you use his computer. Hopefully he won't be there. If he is, I'll just have to think of something. I'll just have to the think of something as he like pats captain. the gun on his side. Charged with treason, a capital offense. We don't have a lot of options. I break into the ambassador's computer, or I take my chances with the patrols in Citadel control. Break into his office. <laughs> Anything we'll to shoot that motherfucker. The ambassador's computer. I was hoping you'd say that. The ambassador has made this personal. You ready to get the hell off this station, Commander? Not yet. I need to ask you about Bench. I still have some things to take care of. Come see me when you're ready to do this. I'll be right here waiting for you. 
Can I ask you about Bane? You ready to get the hell off this station? Damn it. Right? Yeah, I pretty much locked myself out of that fucking quest. Alright, anyways, let's go. Let's do it. I'll take care of the lockdown. You get down to the Normandy and tell Joker to stand by. Gotta have one last little shakedown, you know? Before we go. Alrighty, let's get the hell out of here. We've been here far too long. Do I just go to the Normandy? I think I just go to the Normandy, right? Where's the, uh, not the M MC? Four locations? Docking Bay? Where's Docking Bay? Oh, shit. I guess I, uh. I don't want to teleport straight to the Normandy because I don't want to. F I don't want the mods to like fuck something up. So uh, we'll head to the embassies. Not the embassies. Fuck. I'm stupid. The way to the docking bay is through C sect. I'm a fucking idiot. Why'd I do that? I think I just want to see Anderson punch Dina. <laughs> I was like to the embassies. Alrighty. This is the docking bay? Yo. Treaty negotiations between the Alliance and the Solarian Republic have finally concluded. Solarians praised the openness and flexibility of Alliance negotiators in pursuing a deal that benefited both sides. Oh, good thing I gave that guy the, uh, negotiator, Thomas Kent, the guy the fucking depressants. Mentor, nice. Elias Keeler withdrew, citing health reasons. Citing drug addictions. You guys ready to go? Ready to head out. Once you hop on the Normandy, you will not be able to head back to the Citadel. Until the end of the game. So, uh, make sure you do what you gotta do. Anderson? What are you doing here? I didn't send. <laughs> <laughs> I swear to God, it looks like a fucking like early two thousands source filmmaker, fucking like YouTube video, just walking in there like it's God of War. Get us out of here, Joker! Now. Look how beautiful Joker is. With those new mods, we were able to afford him some plastic surgery, which he didn't need. I think Joker is one of the best looking NPCs in the first game, right? He was already pretty beautiful. Let's see if I can talk to the, uh, to the council. Maybe I can call him and tell him to fuck off. Damn it. No. Wish I could. Alright. We're back in space. And I guess before uh, we do anything, we should talk to the crew members, right? Nah, let's talk to Joker. We might get something out of him. How you feeling, Joker? Aw, oh, damn it. No sign of pursuit? I was hoping the council would send some ships after us. I was looking forward to putting the Normandy through her paces. I figured I get to see what this ship can really do. Saren's still out there. Maybe we'll get a chance to play hide and seek with Sovereign. You know, it doesn't seem like much fun when you say it, Commander. So you need something? Fuck you, Joker. I have to go. <laughs> you piece of shit. You. you wanted me to play along, so I played along. I should have just told I should have just told you to shut the fuck up. You're gonna be that type of guy. Joker sitting there like, man, I was hoping to shoot down some of our own fucking comrades. Like, alright, Joker, you fucking bloodthirsty bastard. I know you stuck to a chair, but doesn't mean you gotta take revenge against the whole universe. Hi, Chakwes. Since Kaiden's dead, you got nothing to talk to. <laughs> nothing to talk to me about. Hey, Liara, how you feeling? This will all be over soon, Shepard. One way or another. 
okay? I didn't even get to, like, respond to her. She's just like, yep. What's up, Shepard? Bye, Shepard. The slowest fucking elevator in this goddamn game. Oh my god, I can't wait to get rid of it. Garrus, anything to say? I can't believe we stole the Normandy. I mean, I'm not surprised after everything you've told me. But still. So long, I say. We'll be fine, Garrus. Just be ready when we find Saren. Yes, Commander. I want you to shoot him. How are you feeling, Rex? Stealing an Alliance ship? Risky stuff. But I'm right behind you, Shepard. It's the least I can do. Just say that you love me, big boy. You think I'm crazy, don't you? Sometimes crazy is the best way to go. I just hope they don't catch us before we get our hands on Saren. They won't. With you... Anything's possible. I love you, Daddy Shepard. So I love you too, Rex. Actually, you know what? <laughs> basically, in Mass Effect 2, when we meet Grunt, basically it is I love you, Daddy Shepard. He's like, <laughs> you, you open him from the tank, he's like, are you my papa? We're fugitives on the run. Very exciting, Shepard. I wonder what the council would do to us if we got caught. Dally, calm down. You're making the floor wet. Your father probably had some political pull, right? He wouldn't let them throw his little girl in jail. You don't know my father. Stealing ships is a capital offense among my people. He'd probably want to execute us himself. Stealing ships is a capital offense, you know, since we live on a ship? Oh yeah, it's like stealing your home. I get it. You guys really got, like, home issues, huh? Alright. Not a problem. The Normandy's the best ship in the fleet. They'll never catch us. I hope you're right. I should go. See you later. My god, every time she says that, she sounds so fucking sad. I can just imagine her reaching her hand out, being like, See you later, Shepard. Oh. It was like, I'm gonna go talk to Ashley. Okay, see you later. <laughs> hey, Ash, how you feeling? Commander? How you doing? What's your opinion on the last mission? We've got a hard fucking... Okay, nothing. Nothing new. Against us. Screw the odds. When it... That's what pisses me off. We'll talk later. Will you? Looking forward to. She basically had nothing new to say. All right, Rex, I got some armor for you, homeboy. Boom. Looking all beautiful and magnificent and shit. I also bought you a uh, upgrade for your bullshit. Wait, you already had both of these? Wait, I'm sorry. I'm having a moment right here. What? Wait. How do I check what fucking... <laughs> How do I check what you got, Rex? Details. R RB? Fuck. LB? There we go. Wait, what do you got? Point three, point three. Okay. So they're basically the same. Alright, cool. And this one is a... Uh, oh, fuck. Yeah, this one's... Okay. Well, I thought I got something new for you, Rex, but, but I guess I didn't. Oh, wait. No, I did. There you go. For some reason, they're all the way at the bottom. I hate the way they sort shit in, uh... I hate the way they fucking sort shit in Mass Effect 1. It's so annoying. And just real quick, I want to check uh, my equipment, because I know I got some better guns now, right? Right? Mmm. Mmm. Look at that. Yes. I'm good. Anything, anything with the shotguns? Real quick. Ooh. Look at that. I think that was literally the exact same pistol I might have had. I might have just, like, not did anything. This one's better, though. And then I also just want to change Garrus' sniper, because I think I got a better sniper for him this time. No, I don't. Alright, well, fuck it. Okay, let's go do some missions. 
First things first, I want to head back to Novaria, pick up that package I need to fucking pick up that I completely forgot about. Because I'm an idiot. I just walked right past it. As long as he doesn't need me to take it to the Citadel, we're good. But if we gotta take it to the Citadel, then that's a lost cause. None I can do there. And then we're gonna do the uh, two DLC missions. Pinnacle Station and Bring Down the Sky. I think I'm gonna do Pinnacle Station first though. Message coming in. Patching it through. Commander, Ms. Algelani's story on you just aired. The brass isn't happy with the way you treated her. This comes straight from the Joint Military Command. I don't care. I punched her lights out. I'm gonna do it again in the second game. I don't have game. the patience to deal with tabloid gadflies who think they're great journalists. Commander, if she had done that at a bar, she'd go home in an ambulance. But they want me to make this clear. We can't mistreat the press. Just wanted to let you know what the response was back home. I don't care. Don't keep you any longer. Fifth Fleet out. I'm a Spectre. I think everybody punches that lady in the face. <laughs> there's no avoid. There's not fucking. I can sit here like I'm goddamn Doctor Strange and go through all the fucking realities and timelines and shit. There is no timeline where that lady does not get punched in the face. Fucking. Fucking. You know, uh, Doctor Strange in there. He's like, ah, oh, there's only one possibility of us winning this time he's in there he's like there's zero possibility of her not getting knocked the fuck out <laughs> jesus let's go pick up that package yeah. We're here to smuggle shit. Oh, fuck. I just realized while I was down there in the... Ah, oh, damn it. You know what? I might as well check it right now since I'm still technically on the Normandy, you know? Well, since it technically hasn't, like, changed, uh, like, loading states, I guess. I don't know how to explain it. But basically, when you pop up on the Normandy, Homeboy has different shit in his stock. I didn't check it yet. I should have checked it earlier when I went down there. Completely forgot about him. So before we walk off the Normandy and walk back on with the package, might as well just see if he has any Colossus armor on him. If not, then uh, fuck it, right? Looking for supplies? Yes, I am. Let's see what you've got. You bet, Commander. You bet, Commander. Predator's pretty good, but that's not what we're after. Nope, nothing. Maybe next time. Yep, maybe next time. All right. They could at least put like some elevator music or something. It, it's so slow. I hate it. I hate every time I gotta go downstairs for something. Alrighty. Now, up, 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 up. Who's coming with us? Rex and Liara. Logged. The commanding officer is ashore. Exo Presley has the deck. They just treat this place as a common area now. Since there's really like, you know, take that package, right? Eh, might as well. Might as well have a quick look around, see if anything changed on Novario while we're here. Because there is more merchants here too, so might as well. I would be grateful if you would finish your business and leave. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> I hate this damn lady. Let's see if there was anything back there. Would it be faster to go in the elevator? Eh, fuck it. It's just right down here, right? You okay, Rex? What the fuck? Rex neck's what? <laughs> Rex neck was crooked, but then Tally, oh, Tally, fucking Liara's the one sitting here going, "Oh, I gotta stretch my neck." Now Shepard's doing it. What the fuck's wrong with you guys? Let 
You got any licenses for me? Do you have the package? The customer grows restless. Alright, yeah, I got it. Alright, damn. I'm keeping it, it's mine. Here you are. The Spectre has done a great service for this one. From the deepness of light, it thanks you. <coughs> this one promised compensation for services rendered. It humbly suggests that a sum of 250 credits would be most appropriate. Any other time I'll renegade the shit out of this, but I literally did nothing special, so uh, yeah, sure. Yeah, it is. That sounds reasonable. Then this business is concluded. Is there anything else the other should like? I would like to buy things, actually. Show me what you're selling. Of course. Non-human uh, armors. Check that. Phoenix X. Ooh, that's a good one, too. Predator L. But that's nine. Warlord. How may this one assist? Show me what you're selling. Of course. Any licenses or upgrades on it? Metagel upgrades? Mm, it's pretty, pretty good. Cinderi explosives. Proton round. Eh, eh, it's alright, it's alright. We're fine. I want to check down here, see if there's anything new since we uh, arrested what's his face. Oh, she's not at her desk. Well, she's not an assistant anymore, I guess. Is she running the place? Oh, you're running the place. Spectre, how good of you to return. Fucking congratulations, dude. You're the administrator now? Quite so. It is all thanks to you. With the evidence you recovered, I was able to present my case to the executive board. Mr. Analeas was asked to submit his resignation. The board gave me his position. Uh, let's say out of gratitude. That's cool, man. Now, if you don't mind, I have many operations to bring myself up to speed on. That's cool. I'm happy about that. I want to see if uh, the Torian down here, if he has anything to sell for us. I highly doubt it, but, you know, might as well check out. Because I don't know why the fuck he asks if, if there's anything he can do for us, but he does. if he doesn't have anything to sell, then why the fuck does he ask if he can't do jack shit, you know? Got anything useful? What can I do for you? Hey there. I have to go. What, okay. <laughs> you need anything? I'll be here. You can't do anything for me. You can't even do for me anything for me story wise. Why are you here? <laughs> what is the point of you? I don't get it. I guess he tells us to go talk to what's his face. Uh like to help move along the story but that's all he does like the character before him could have done that he's useless i don't know why he's there all right Let's see if anything changed in here Anything change with you? Nope. Can I talk to this fucking Torian up here? Not Torian. What, what the hell are you? Krogan? You still didn't tell me to fuck off? Go find something else to do. Stupid mammal. Well, that's the first time I ever heard you say that. Wow, okay, that one was that one had some hatred in it. Oh, wait, oh god. Rex, you confused me. I thought you were just a random NPC. Just sitting in the corner pointing your gun. <laughs> Fucking weirdo. Alright, let's get the hell out of here. Back to Normandy. And let's head to uh, Pinnacle Station. The DLC that they couldn't put in the, leg in the legendary the edition. Because we lost Exo the source code or whatever the fuck. Relieved. Listen, I may not be that educated on how to make a game, but I feel like anytime a company goes, we couldn't do X because we lost the source code or something. My mind just goes, can't you just, like, grab it from a version of the game that you have somewhere? 
uh, it would take too many man hours and blah blah blah. It's like why was the why were the modders able to put it back in within like four months? Like, <laughs> I never get that shit. Looking for supplies? Like, I know things would be easier and probably less expensive with the source code, but you know, you can you can work around it. You can't Let's really call it got. the le you fucking can. legendary edition or whatever the fuck when you don't have everything in the game. Damn it! He does have that uh that predator? Oh, predator aim for Krogan. Damn it! All right. Nothing, nothing I want. All right. To Pinnacle Station. That's where we're going. That's what we're gonna do. Little fun fact: I don't think I've ever played the Pinnacle Station DLC. I'm pretty sure I haven't. So this will be my first time actually seeing this bullshit. Is it as good as people say it is? I don't know. It might be the best one. Let's see if it's as good as everyone says it is. After we watch this non-skippable cutscene that I that I fucking put, <laughs> I was putting when I was putting mods on here, and it's like, oh, the 4K versions of the fucking little cutscenes and shit. Mod that in, and I was like, how many gigs is that? And I was like, oh, that's a lot. Why am I doing this? Pinnacle Station! Yay! I hope the game doesn't break in half. Oh, wait, I'm here by myself? Am I supposed to be here by myself? Am I not supposed to have teammates? Oh, I'm a little scared. Isn't that Commander Shepard? The human Spectre? Whatever. Spectre or no, it's always fun to see humans get pummeled in the simulator. Ah, yes, just like the simulations. Go pester Ahern, human. I'm on. Commander Shepard. I'm sorry, you said his name was Ahern? Go pester Ahern, human. I'm Ahern. on. Ahern. That's a. That's a name. Nice to have you aboard, Commander. Sorry, I just kind of want to explore a little bit. I've never been here before, right? I'm a little excited. Scoreboards. Oh, so what is it? Just like a survival mode? Is that what this is? So, you must be the famous Commander Shepard. I'm tech specialist Alud Ocran, lead programmer on the combat simulator. Do you need something? I'm sure I have a few minutes before someone forgets their password and comes crying to me for help. Hmm, I don't know, your proposition eludes me. Boodoom ching! Haha, <laughs> your name's weird. Alright. Start mission. What? How about the simulator? So how does this work? It's a combination of holographic images and kinetic barriers. Holographic images help you see the objects, and the kinetic barriers keep you from walking through them. Oh, so it's all virtual? I assume the enemies are also holographic? No. Our operatives train in a simulator by killing real, actual people. That's cool. <sighs> They're simulated. That's lame. But I hear the kinetic slugs hurt just the same. You sound like you're getting enjoyment out of this. You okay? What's with the attitude? I'm a technical genius on a station full of soldiers who only respect battlefield prowess. It's more than a little frustrating. It's okay. Turn that frown upside down. I've been watching the smiling friends today. <laughs> My first time watching it. It's a good show. Keep these soldiers at their Can't best. wait for season two. That's extremely valuable. I suppose so. It would just be nice to get credit for it once in a while. So what do you want me to do? Like suck you off? What the fuck? I can't do nothing about that. I'm I'll sorry. It's your job. Time. Then go play somewhere else. I have work to do. Reward you with a fucking bullet to the back of the dome. Hey, that's Shepard. Best of luck, Commander. That's the most happiest Krogan I've ever met in my life. That makes me happy. Hey, that shepherd <laughs> over there. Whoa. Making my four, my four testicles jump. 
Like I'm a like I'm the main character of Part 8 in JoJo. Ah, Commander Shepard. Welcome to Pinnacle Station. I'm Admiral Taddeus Ahern. I'm glad I got the invite. Where do we begin? You'll be training in the combat simulator. After each round, you'll see how you fared against your competitors. Okay. My, wait, my competitors? Who will I be competing against? The best of the best. Oh, the, the online leaderboard. The travel here from all over to try their hand at the simulator. The scores are tallied, and the winners appear on these monitors for all to see. Get your name there, and the entire Alliance will know about it. I think the entire Alliance know my name already, but okay. How do I try out a combat scenario? Go talk to Ocran over in the staging area. He'll set you up and let you choose a scenario. Okay. So you run the station and the training here? Last I checked. It's better than a desk job and a hell of a lot better than retirement. The facility is magnificent. It has all the technological marvels a commander needs to train the perfect soldier. The Turians give their advice. Every so often, I listen to them. He's like, sometimes when you go Thanks to the, the gym, info. the guy telling you Carry that on. you're doing your squat wrong might actually be right. So just keep, yeah, you know, listen to everything. You know, you keep an open mind. My God, fucking Torian right here just presenting. Looking all sexy and lizardy. <laughs> Let's get weird. Scoreboards? Okay, yeah, I don't, I don't need to fuck with that. All right, well, let's start the simulation. You need something then. else. Let's start let's it. Let's try a new simulation. New competitors are restricted to low impact missions till they learn the ropes. The infirmary was starting to complain. Which combat mode? Time trial, capture, survival, or hunt? Uh. I feel like I might be here forever if I do survival. Let's go with hunt. Sign me up for a hunt mission. All right. I can get you set up in either the subterranean level or the volcanic level. Uh, there's too many volcano levels in places. I mean, we just got done doing Resident Evil 5. I'm good. Subterranean sounds good. Fine. We give you some dummy grenades and metagel. If you try to use a real grenade, I will turn off every safety measure this simulator has. <laughs> He's like, I will fucking end you if you break anything. Rex, you're gonna wreck house, and if... And the smart move would be to bring Ashley, too. Because they're both just powerhouses. But Liara is like a fucking nuke. Boo, Shepard! You need to kill to keep a hunt mission going. I thought you said boo. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, you're scaring me, stop it. Alright, well... I... I want to save it for my Intimidate, but I don't even think I would need it at this point. Honestly. And basically, I don't use anything but Barrier, so... It's not Mass Effect 2. I'm not gonna be fucking around with menus, like, forever. Oh, shit! You said we gotta kill to keep going? Alright, cool. Um, hmm. Get this out. Get it nice and ready. Started running towards me. <laughs> that looked like it hurt. How we doing? Doing good? This shit has no recoil on it. Oh shit, I hit the lamp. Oh fuck, you're still alive? Yeah, we're doing pretty alright. Come on, show your face. I know you're around the corner. Alright. 
and start running around blasting fools. Forty-four hostiles. All right. I'm not sure if that's good or bad, but I, I did something. Yeah, I'm number one. I did. It. I'm the best. Back off, Fidinos. I haven't done anything wrong. If you've tampered with government equipment, Brian, I'll have you thrown in the stockade. What seems to be the problem? Get lost, Shepard. This doesn't concern you. Vidinos is just mad because a human beat his record. <laughs> Shut your mouth, hollow jockey. Brian says he scored highest in missions from multiple combat modes. No human's ever done that. He clearly cheated. Hmm. Perhaps not. Would you change your mind if I scored highest on those missions? Tell you what, Shepard. You beat my record and Brian won't spend the rest of the competition in the stockade. Hell, if you even come close, I'll give you my weapon. I'd better go make some room in my trophy case. You're confident, Shepard. But that'll only take you so far. I hope Bryant has something to read. He'll be in that stockade for a long time. Kind of talks like a pirate. You're confident, I. You be confident, Shepard. But that'll only take you so far. Do you need something else? Let's try a new simulation. So what is it? Do I just I'm like... Here to serve. Do I Which just... combat mode? Time trial, capture, survival, or hunt? No, I never mind. Hold, Hold up. For now. Then why are you here? I'll be back. Then go play somewhere else. Oh my god, I'm gonna I'm gonna beat the shit out of this guy. <laughs> Keep talking to me like that. All right. So uh, what is it? Time trials. Wait, are these all time trials? Oh, do I have to do it for like each course? Wait. Okay. Wait. No, I gotta beat the tropical course. Is it just the time trial ones? Oh no, I gotta do it for every single fucking one of them? Oh, that's so much work! Oh, actually, it doesn't seem that much. Okay, never mind. I thought it would be way more than that. How long are the time trials? Oh, I kinda wanna do it, but that'll take us forever. Damn it. For every mode and like every fucking location too. Damn. Do you need something else? Let's try a new simulation. I'm here to serve. Which combat mode? Time trial, capture, survival, or hunt? <sighs> yes, hunt. Sign me up for a hunt mission. All right. I can get you set up in either the subterranean level or the volcanic level. Give me a volcanic. Fine. The projectors are warming up. You can start whenever. Cool. Yeah, I guess I'm just gonna be running with Liara and Rex then the whole entire time if it if I need to go for like speed. Don't just stand there looking pretty, kill something. I like looking pretty. Alright. I was confused for a moment. I was like, how the fuck do I get over there? Ugh, all pain, no gain. <laughs> Why the hell is he talking like that? Ugh, all pain, no gain. Alright, guess I gotta use a sniper then if I'm gonna be doing time trials and shit. Wait, you killed him already, Rex? Shit. Really are one of you fuckers did it. You're feel that one tomorrow. Oh, 
Oh shit, the railing's in the way. There we go. Are they all just up there now? My aim is so fucking bad. Come on, poke your little head out. Come on. There you go. Oh! Kill it! Kill it with fire! Good to go. Come on. There we go. <laughs> he fell down the steps. <laughs> this fucking looking stupid. Forty two. Come on. Forty-eight. Damn. I don't think I beat it. Did I? Oh, I did. Okay. Just about. Five more points. Shepard, your accomplishments are an inspiration to knuckleheads everywhere. Shoot first, ask questions later. I like it. I like the DLC. Do you need something else? It's good. <laughs> it feels good to shoot things. Alright. <clears throat> Let's try a new simulation. I'm here to serve. Which combat mode? Time trial, capture, survival, or hunt? Sign me up for a hunt. Alright. I can get you set up in either the subterranean level or the okay. volcanic level. I just want to see I'd if like, like a new location was unlocked or something. Which combat mode? Time trial, capture, survival, or hunt? Let's try one of the timed missions. And which course? I've got the warehouse or tropical courses. Uh, let's go with tropical. I think I'll see how I do with the tropical course. The projectors are warming up. You can start whenever. If it's a time trial... Hmm. Garrus might die in like two hits though. If I can get Garrus to like just snipe shit, that'd be great. I don't know, we'll just stick with these two. It's pretty pretty good team. Get moving, this is a time trial. Where do I gotta go though? I don't know where I'm supposed to go. Hostile spotted. Oh, I just have to kill them all? Okay. Come on, Rush Shepard, don't get stuck now. Yeah, you gotta feel that one tomorrow. <laughs> Punch him out. Oh, that's Rex. <laughs> you scared me, Rex. I thought you were in me, okay? Is that it? Good. Six more. Where? Where? Where is he? One seventeen. By three seconds, okay. This might not take as long as Keep I thought. Keep up the adequate work, Commander.
I guess, uh... Hmm. I guess when I'm doing the time travel, I should just use the sniper else. then. Let's try a new scenario. I'm here. Which combat mode? Seems like it would be faster. Trial, capture, survival, Let's try one of the And time. which course? I've got the warehouse. Set me up in the warehouse. The projectors are warming up. Get moving. This is a time trial. Uh, yeah, we're good. Enemy contact. Oh. Wait. <laughs> You're not on my team? Who are you? You sneaky bastard. Okay, shotgun would be better for the warehouse. Shotgun definitely better for the warehouse. Close quarters. This way, team. Damn it, Shepard. That meta gel ain't free. What meta gel? I didn't even use meta gel. Shut the hell up. What are you talking about? Okay, 110. I think we're done here. Yeah, that was definitely way better. Shepard, your accomplishments are an inspiration to knuckleheads everywhere. I can't skip. I can't skip his compliments. He just loves me so much. But also, I, I literally cannot skip his compliments. The game will not let me. Do you need something else? Let's try a new simulator. I'm which combat mode? Time trial, capture, survival, or hunt? Capture. You have your choice. I'd like to try something. Oh shit! I didn't press that. I'm sorry. Time capture. You have your choice between the volcanic or tropical. Coordinate. What's my mission in capture mode? Capture all designated control points as quickly as possible. Oh. After you capture all the control points, you have your choice between the volcanic or tropical. The projectors are warming up. If we're just capturing a point, then I guess we're going to be under a lot of fire. Yeah, no, I'll, I think I'll just, yeah, I'll just stick with Rex and the R. It's definitely, like, the strongest team that I got going. This is very simple, Shepard. Reach the point, capture the point, and repeat. Well, where's the point? You gotta tell me where the point is at. Is it where the enemies are at? I, I don't know. Do I check my map? <laughs> where's the point? Oh, that's the point. Okay, I see. Get the hell over there. Regroup. Team, get the hell over here. Point captured, moving on. One all the fuck the way over here. It's gonna be a pretty easy one. Just sitting pretty. Uh, where's the last point? You guys never told- Oh, it's up here. Damn it. Oh yeah, I, I must have fucked up then. I might have to do this one again. You guys really should put markers on the map or something so I don't fucking run around not knowing where the hell to go. I'm not using Metagel. Shut up. 
I get that I'm getting quote-unquote shot, but I got a barrier up, all right? Oh, I still did better by one second. <laughs> wow. All right. I don't have time to fucking do a Commander, whole circuit. Your ability to weigh the pros and cons of standing in the way of gunfire seems to be improving. <laughs> pros and cons of standing in the way of gunfire? <laughs> you mean just like, I'm literally just a wall. Do you need something else? Let's try a new simulation. I'm here to serve. Which combat mode? Time trial, capture, survival, or hunt? You gotta capture. Capture. You have your choice between. I'd like to try something else. Which combat mode? Time capture. trial. Capture. You have your choice between the volcanic or trust. Set me up. The projectors are warming up. This is very simple, Shepard. Reach the point, capture the point, and repeat. One of the points has to be up here, right? Okay, cool. <laughs> Didn't even load in. Like Call of Duty. I just spawned, man! What the hell? Come on, where's the next point? Is it not down here? Is it in the fucking warehouse? Okay, it's in the warehouse. Wow, this is the smallest point to capture ever. Damn it, Shepard, that minute shell ain't free. You guys better fucking let me walk out. Not get in my way. Time for this bullshit. Point gotta be up here, right? I just kind of point my gun at the door. Good work, Shepard. Talk out the way, Liara. Oh wait, what? It was only three points. Oh, I should have went the other way then. Fuck. Still did it though. By 30. That was the easiest one. On the bright side, Shepard, any intelligent enemy you come across will know how foolish it would be to face you. Good thing most people I walk into aren't that intelligent, right? Alright, just want to see. Hunt tropical. Why is that locked? Oh, we didn't. We didn't do hunt on. Okay, yeah, yeah, because yeah, it's locked for because we're still quote unquote newbies or whatever the fuck. Okay, survival. Volcano is one thirty one, so I just gotta go to one thirty two, and tropical is one forty. So, okay, one thirty two and one fifty. Pretty much. That's not too hard. Do you need something else? Let's try a new simulation. I'm here to serve. Which combat mode? Time trial, capture, survival, or hunt? I'll go with survival mode. Now pick a course. Do you want volcanic or tropical? And I could use some sun. Boot up. The projectors are warming up. All right. You two will protect me as I throw my berry up and just, just start reading a book. It doesn't have to be pretty. Just keep yourself alive. Oh, you already started shooting, huh? <laughs> My shield did nothing! This mode is just shooting and have fun, pretty much. My man started moonwalking towards me, what the fuck? Shotgun. So beautiful. <laughs> that looked like it hurt. Wait, how do I like oh shit. I'm gonna have to like kill myself in order to end it, right? Since I'm so damn invincible.
move, Rex. What the hell? I'm shooting Rex in the ass by accident. Damn, nice shot. Oh! Get him, Rex. He's gonna start meleeing. That means he won't take showers for days. <laughs> oh wait, I already did it, right? Yeah, I already did it. Okay, how do I how do I die now? You can kill me. You you can kill you can you can guess I'll blow myself up then. Did it? Oh. <laughs> A good leader never lets his team down as I'm blowing up all three of us. There's a reason they made you a specter. I'm happy it doesn't take uh, getting all these high scores against the CPU doesn't fucking take you as long as I thought else. it would. Let's try a new simulation. I'm here to serve. Which combat mode? Time trial, capture, survival, or hunt? I'll go with survival mode. Now pick a course. Do you want volcanic or tropical? Let's go with the volcanic course. Fine. The projectors are warming up. You can start whenever. I'm gonna hide in the warehouse. Put my back against it. It doesn't have to be pretty. Just keep yourself alive. Oh, they closed off the warehouse. <laughs> Sorry, Shepard, but there's no award for most times shot. That's the way. <laughs> Just knock him up in the head with a gun. How did I miss that? Oh my god. Where's my aim? You guys are like really surviving these sniper shots. I love how these headshots don't even fucking count. That's great. It's okay though. I shot that one in the ass, he died. <laughs> Did we do it yet? Oh. Gotta go to like 150. Damn, Liara. Shit. You didn't have to nuke him. I mean, you had to, but like, you know. How many shots did that guy take? Oh, I'm at two minutes already? Shit. Ouch. Watch yourself. Get down. Watch your squad mates. There we go. I guess after this I would unlock like the other areas for the other stuff. Aukron must have changed it. Or... There's a bug in the simulator. You got lucky, human. That wasn't luck. It was skill. Skill at cheating the system, maybe. I'll get to the bottom of this soon enough. Bryant is clear. Keep your smug grin to yourself. I'm out of here. Yeah, not so fast. You gonna hand over the gear you owe me? Or do I have to take it myself? But of course. Unlike some competitors aboard this station, I am a man of character. Hmm. 
Let me think of what Mies would like. I think I can go for a new sniper. Maybe? Or a pistol? Let's go for a new sniper. I'll take that sniper rifle. Go ahead. Thing's a piece of garbage anyway. Enjoy the burn when it blows up in your hand. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh Is the game saving? Is it freezing? What's going on? Uh-oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm scared. Don't, don't die on me, game. Please don't tell me. Please don't tell me something fucked up. Nothing's happening. I'm pressing all the buttons. I'm scared. I haven't seen an autosave in who knows how long. Maybe if I wait it out, we'll all be good, right? There was no bugs with the... The mod didn't have any bugs, did it? Was I not supposed to do this? <laughs> Probably. Probably like fucking with the save or something. I don't know. Let me see. Mass Effect, Pinnacle Station. Odd. Was there something I wasn't supposed to do? Or is this just a co-winky dink? Let's see, changes, how it was ported, requirements, installation. Uh-huh, uh-huh, mm-hmm. I'm not seeing any bug reports here. I assume they would put that in the thing. What if I go and I click on, let me see, maybe if I check the, that's the description. What about post on it? Oh, wait, nope. I think I see a bug report. Wait a minute. Let me see. Crash with quick loop mod. Oh. Yeah, okay. Wait, no. What is this? This is not a problem with this mod. That's what they say. They say it's not a bug. See? This is not a bug, I guess just had I guess I just had like a freak accident then. Alright, well shit. Guess I'm gonna restart Mass Effect and pray to God that it didn't fuck up my safe flow. I'm gonna have to restart Mass Effect. Damn it. Alrighty. Hold up. Be right back. You know what? I'm gonna take a bathroom break while I do this actually. Intermission time.
All right, we're back. Let's see if my save file was corrupted or not. If it was, you might hear a grown man cry today. Oh, oh, we got a Pinnacle Station one. Hold up. Wait a minute. Whoa, hold up. Okay. Let me just check something real quick. Got to change this and this. All right. Let's go check. Let's see, Shepherd, Shepherd. Ah, uh, Volcano One. That was the last one I did. Oh, subterranean. Wait, hold up. Wait, no, it's Volcano for combat mode. Wait, is that because I? Wait, no. Wait. So do I have the? Oh, I think I I think it saved it. Way to kick some ass, Shepard. That's my favorite Krogan, I love him. Do you need something else? Let's try a new simulation. Well, well. Your performance was just oh, reviewed. Shit. You now have access to the last set of missions. Which combat mode? Time trial, capture, survival, or hunt? Okay, so the game just crashed at like a bad time, I guess, but it saved all the progress we just did, so that's good. Sucks that it crashed, but that's good though. At least we finished the mission. Or the challenge or whatever. Capture. Good choice. And for courses I have volcanic, tropical, and subject. Oh actually before I do else. all this. Which combat hold up. mode? I'll hold I'll be back another Then time. go play somewhere else. Before I do this, I just wanna see oops, that was a weird little skippage there. I just wanna see. Hmm. Oh. Survival two twenty? Okay. Okay, yeah, 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 all right. So the longest one for, all right, just wanted to see what the things I would have to beat is. Uh, I believe the last thing, I'm not sure if I gotta beat those to get the apartment, because I think Pinnacle Station is where you get an apartment. So I'm gonna talk to the Admiral, see if he just goes like, here's an apartment dog or whatever, if I have to beat the stuff. Medinos is pissed off, Shepard. Well done. You still got a way to go before you're the best, though. So what's next? What's the plan now that Vadinos is out of the way? I suggest you go back in there and finish the rest of the missions. Prove to everyone that you're the best. <clears throat> I guess. I never back down from a challenge. That's what I like to hear. Go show those aliens what a human can do. Good luck out there, Shepard. Am I supposed to get an apartment for this? Is that Pinnacle Station? Does Pinnacle Station give you an apartment? Or, or is that something in Mass Effect 3? Let me look that up before I before I waste my time. <laughs> before I do something that might waste time. All right. Yeah, I'm hitting shit. Hitting shit that I'm not supposed to be hitting. Much like an abusive husband, I was hitting things I wasn't supposed to be. <laughs> All right. Let me see. Uh, Pinnacle Station rewards. Yeah, sure. Possible scenarios is an apartment where you can get a piece of loot from one of the three convoys. While this can be expensive, it gives you access to the best equipment in the game. Uh, okay, well then, how the f do you get it? So, do I just have to do everything? Apartment, where do you get that shit? Wait. That for Mass Effect 2? Wait, what is this? We're gonna check an IGN guide. Let's see. Oh no, yeah, this is Mass Effect 1. Okay. Uh da -da 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 -da. I'll bring down the sky. Okay. Envoy. This page of IGN's Mass Effect wiki is about to come okay i thought it was missing for a moment <laughs> i was about to be like what the fuck what are you talking about by completing the combat mission task which requires you to get top score in every combat mode in every mo okay yeah all right okay 
Eliminate supply of energy and grenades. Blah, blah, blah. blah. Alright, so my. Oh, Alright, I see. Might as well do it. Might as well do it. Much like Emperor Palpatine said, do it. <laughs> Alrighty. Do you need something else? Let's try a new simulation. I'm here to serve. Which combat mode? Time trial, capture, survival, or hunt? Capture. Good choice. And for courses, I have volcanic, tropical, and subterranean. Why do I choose tropical? I'm such a moron. Fine. The projectors are warming up. You can start whenever. No, I don't want to do it. I'm sorry. Fuck. Damn it. I don't know why I did that. I don't know why I chose tropical. What the fuck's wrong with me? Is there a way to exit out of here? This is very simple, Shepard. Reach the point, capture the point, and repeat. Better luck like next time. There we go. <laughs> I fucked up, okay? I fucked up. I chose the wrong one. I didn't mean to. Do you need something else? Let's try a new simulation. I'm... Which combat mode? Time trial, capture, survival, or hunt? Capture. Good choice. And for courses, I have volcanic, tropical, and subterranean. There we go. Projectors are warming up. Subterranean. That's what I was supposed to be choosing. Get to the point and keep it at all costs. I guess one of the points will be up here. If not, I'm gonna look like a fucking fool. One point captured. Running, running, running over here. Where's the other point? Is it over there? I'm gonna assume it's over there because I, I don't see a marker. Shot at Liara for fun. <laughs> I don't know why I did it. We did it! Yay! Barrier is pretty fucking overpowered in Mass Effect 1. Please don't, please don't freeze. Wow, Shepard. The only way your team could have made better use of their unique talents is if you'd gone into battle with your eyes crossed. All right, so just three more challenges. Do you need something else? Let's try a new simulation. I'm here to... Which combat mode? Time trial, capture, survival, or hunt? Sign me up for a hunt mission. Let's see. For hunt mode, I can boot up the subterranean, volcanic, or tropical levels. I'll go with the tropical. The projectors are warming up. All right. Boo, Shepard! You need to kill to keep on mission going. I'm going, I'm going, I'm getting ready to kill, alright? I'm getting getting ready to kill, alright? Don't run away from them, Liara. That's it, Shepard. They're only holograms. Very convincing holograms. Damn it, I'm gonna have to run back for the other- Ah, oh, shit. I'm running out of time. Doing this the stupid way. Rex, are you okay, bro? You got them? Alright. Why did they have to spawn in, like, two different areas like that? You're gonna feel that one tomorrow. What the hell? Oh, thanks, Liar. You're gonna feel that one tomorrow. Twenty-eight 
23 left. <laughs> Running backwards. There we go. Never knew what hit it. Oh, come on. Stop spawning away from me. spitting rockets at me and shit. You okay, Rex? Going, I can't shoot my gun. Okay, that was weird. range ass rocket I think I got the high score right I don't think there's anything higher than 60 shouldn't be watch it be fucking like 70 alright got two more to do that's odd Shepard I've never seen the holograms cry like that before. Like I'm fucking Vegeta, talking to Android 19. Tell me, do androids cry? Do you need something else? Let's try a new simulation. I'm here to serve. Can androids feel fear? Which combat mode? Time trial, capture, survival, or hunt? I just did what? Capture and hunt? Time trial. Let's try one of the timed missions. Which course do you want? I can boot up the warehouse, volcanic, or tropical courses. Boot up the volcanic level. Fine. The projectors are warming up. You can start whenever. Eliminate those hostiles, Shepard! I'll try my best. Alright, Rex, you fucking bloodthirsty animal. Here it comes! Oh my god, that, that grenade's not gonna go off in time. The fuse timer of these fucking grenades suck! This one might be the harder one. Where did these barriers come from? Oh, wait, that's Rex. Ouch. Watch yourself. 
Thought I saw a fucking light. Sorry, Shepard, but there's no reward for most time shot. There's an enemy Krogan. Okay. I was confused as fuck because I thought I was... Why did I throw a fucking grenade? Ah, oh, shit. I think I fucked this one up. I think I fucked this one up. Yeah, I definitely did. I definitely did. Do it again. Run it again. Better luck next time. Hmm. Do you need something else? That one's the harder one. Uh, hmm. I was gonna see if Garrus, if I just like post Garrus up and tell him to start sniping like a madman. Don't wait for them to come to you. But now that I know that they spawn in here. Good work, Shepard. Wait, motherfucker inside? Oh no, you're in the back. I missed twice. Thanks, R thanks, Rex. Thank you. Good work, Shepard. Huh? Still alive? All right, I'm just gonna shoot, and then Rex is gonna do cleanup. I guess that's the plan, right? What the hell? Is this guy, like, actively running away from me? Stop! Stop running! You're making this more difficult than it needs to be. Did it. Hope I didn't fucking fail it. Alright, I didn't. Cool. <laughs> One dude just running away. Wow, Shepard. Making it the so only difficult. Way your team could have made better use of their unique talents as if you'd gone into battle with your eyes crossed. Alright, we got one more challenge, which is to survive for what, two fifty? I think that's what I gotta do. Do you need something else? Let's try a new simulation. I'm here to serve. Which combat mode? Time trial, capture, survival, or hunt? I'll go with survival mode. Now pick a course. I can boot up volcanic, tropical, or subterranean. Give me the subterranean level. Fine. The projectors are warming up. Let's just do, uh, let's just do three minutes just to be on the safe side. It doesn't have to be pretty. Just keep yourself alive. <laughs> what the hell? That was a headshot, but he just looked at me funny. Still alive? Oh my god. Get him, Rex. Ow, hit me with a rocket. Bad. Ah, 
<laughs> he's running towards me and Garrus just knocks him out. Not Garrus, my bad, Rex. That's hilarious. Here you go, Liara. She started dying. Uh oh. Game's starting to crack up a bit. Wait. Oh shit, they killed my shields. Oh, they killed my shields! Who knocked me on the ground? No! <laughs> what the fuck? That went south real fast. Oh, come on. Wow, that went south real fast. Do you need something else? I want to give the last. I got pushed on the ground. The projectors are warming up. You can start whenever. Push me on the ground like I was a fucking, like they were fucking playground bullies. You know what? Since they're geth, you can fuck them up, Tally. I guess maybe. I don't know. Do I gotta? Do I gotta fucking level you up or some shit? I could bring Ashley. Just shotgun rain, right? I'll just keep Liara. Keep it simple. It's just like the real world. The only thing you need to do is survive. Kill them all. <laughs> that looked like it hurt. Oh my god, I just ate like two rockets in a row. Guess I should like keep on the move then. So I don't get pushed over again like last time. Never knew what hit it. Come on team, keep it moving. Let's go for a Sunday jog. I don't even know if Rex is using his barrier or not. I think Liara might be. Yeah, I think Liara was using her barrier. I just kneecapped the shit out of that fucking geth for no reason. can't shoot my gun. For some reason, it won't let me shoot my gun. Oh, that was weird. Ow. That hurt. Liara. Like, move. doing pretty okay. Well, I said we're doing pretty okay. Liara's fucking dead. The hell up, Liara. Is dead again. Good work, I don't worry, it's me and Rex. We're good. We're good. I should have brought. I should have brought Ashley. Here it comes. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Hey. Uh oh. What the hell? They got guns that go through barriers! It's whatever, we made three minutes. Come on, Rex, me and you in our death pack. Why is my health coming back? There we go. We did it. 
I did it. Perimeter secured. Great. Now Pinnacle Station is done. Well, that's all of them. You took the top spot everywhere you could. No one's even surprised anymore. Impressive work in there, Shepard. Got anything else for me to do? There's a special scenario I don't get to offer to many operatives. I want you to give it a shot. Look, kid, you've done well. But I've been through a lot worse, and it wasn't a simulation. But I can make it one, if you're interested. New scenario. You have something else I can try? It's a reenactment of one of my missions. We held off an ambush of Turian assault troops back during the contact war. Just me and a small squad. I haven't finished programming it yet, but it's close enough. You can try it if you like. Let's do it. Keep going. The rules are simple. Survive until you're picked up, if you can. You'll be ridiculously outnumbered. No real cover to speak of. It's the ultimate worst case scenario. Of course, it'll only be a simulation. Then up the difficulty. I don't want it easy. You got balls, Shepard. But it's still just a simulation. Even our best VIs aren't as good as the real thing. Then turn off the safeties. No safeties? Highest level of difficulty? You'll never do it. And then I'll have to explain how a Spectre died on my station. What do you want to bet? A wager, huh? Yeah. Okay. I've got a nice little retirement place on Entice. I never go there, and I don't plan on retiring anytime soon. It's yours if you can beat it. And what are you wagering? My life. Right. So you really want the safeties <laughs> off? And what do I get if Die. you if you don't win? I'll be dead. Error. Oh yeah. I'm not losing my job over this. Set it up. Talk to Ockren. I'll make sure he gets. I'd say good luck. All right. Cool. Great. Amazing. Fantastic. Great. Do you need something else? Let's try a new simulation. I'm here to serve. Which combat mode, time trial, capture, survival, or hunt? I understand Ahern set up a special simulation. For the record, I'm against turning the safeties off. I'll be fine. What about my simulator? I'll be making repairs for weeks. This should be good. I don't say this very often, but good luck. I kind of like you now, Shepard. I know I was an asshole to you, but you're kind of cool. All right, Ashley, I'm going to need you with me because, uh... Liara is definitely gonna die. So, uh. <laughs> no cover or anything? Liara is definitely gonna go poof poof. Terrence have captured a critical colonist data bank. Eliminate the defenders and retrieve the data bank. Then hold out for evac. Sounds fair enough. Ooh, you guys are fucking on my shields already. Uh, can I can I aim? Hello? Uh, okay. For some reason, the button wasn't working. That was weird. Uh huh. Ashley, this is my uh. Where's the, uh, oh, this is the databank? Protect me, team! Cool. Up, Shepard. The fun's just starting. Oh, God. Gotta be like another turn or something somewhere, right? There's one right there. I'm gonna go turn it on. Do, 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 ba, 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 ba. You fucking sniper. Sorry, Ash. I had to shoot him through you.
Oh, that's Rex. <laughs> I'm like, what's that over there? Fucking crowded up there. Sorry, Shepard, but there's no award for most time shot. Oh, shit. Oh, God. I need cover. Rex, my boy. Ashley, fucking, oh god, yeah, she can't even boost herself, damn. Where you at, Ashley? There you go. Close it. Oh my god, Ashley, you're gonna get murked. Just a couple more seconds, guys. No one's dead yet, right? I can't. I can't shoot my gun. I can't shoot my gun. My gun will not shoot. My gun refuses to shoot. I did it. Give me my goddamn apartment. I never thought I'd see the day. Good work, Shepard. Really good work. It was a great challenge. Thanks for setting it up. Makes me wish we had you during the first contact war. Could have saved a lot of human lives. And since I'm a man of my word, my retirement home is yours. Too bad. Now that I've seen you beat that scenario, I almost feel like I could retire. It's been a pleasure working with you, Admiral. Likewise. Call me Ahern. You've earned that too. Ba-boop, ba Where's that dickhead? Oh, by the way, before I leave, I guess I should talk to this dude, right? Shepard, I think you may have actually impressed the old man. Maybe he's just going soft. I doubt that. You're just the best we've ever seen. 
So, do you need anything else? I'll be back another time. Then go play somewhere else. I have work to do. Huh. I can't believe you've beaten us all, Shepard. I like that Krogan. He's my favorite. I like him. He's great. Congratulations, Commander. It's been an honor competing with you. My guy sounds so fucking sad about it. Jesus. Like, he ain't got nothing to live for no more. <laughs> it was nice competing with you. Thanks. What's up, loser? Go pester Ahern, human. I'm on duty. Oh, someone's mad that I'm the best. Commander Shepard. All right. Well, that's Pinnacle Station. Hmm. You know what? Usually when there's DLC with no real, like, story shit to it, I usually, uh, I usually don't really care about it. Pinnacle Station? I'm actually really happy with it. Now let's go check out my summer home. Shepherd's apartment. Ah, uh, look at this. Replenish my grenades. Get my meta gel. My personal computer. Let's see. From blah 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 to Admiral uh, Ahern. Admiral, the convoy will be positioned in the Phoenix system for the next week or so. I have spoken with the captains regarding our arrangement, as usual. If you're willing to pay the delivery fees, we can get you a sample from our weapon shipments. If not, no problem. These remote colonies can use all the guns they can afford. Goodness knows what the Alliance is taking a sweet time. Hmm. I don't. I don't guess I'll go with the expensive one then, huh? What did I get? I, I don't I don't know if I got anything good or not. Do I have to go pick it up or something? I don't know what I got. The hell did I get? Early stage in the Phoenix. Do I do I go to the Phoenix system? Guess I go to the Phoenix system then. What the hell is this? <laughs> Just music? <laughs> okay. Huh. Nice little empty ass retirement home. Okay. Alright. I guess we're heading to the Phoenix system then? I did pay money for something. Paid a lot of money. Well, we are in the Phoenix system actually. Where the fuck do I go? said stuff went into my inventory, so I really don't know if I got anything or not. I want to, I 
don't want to start making trips if I don't have to, you know? What the fuck did I get? <laughs> what, what did I get? Department to the contact, freighter, convoy, current stage in the Phoenix system. Uh, huh. I'm gonna look it up, just in case, if it just like automatically went. It said, I think it said I got stuff, right? Maybe I just didn't get anything good. Uh, let me see. Pinnacle Station Convoy. Let me see. Do, 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 do. The computer. Okay. Uh, next, head to the end of the entry hall. The door on the right. Enter the main solarium. Uh, directly across the room. Personal terminal. Use it to complete the mission. You don't have to do anything. Use terminal. And read the email and then you choose one of three ships to make contact with you should cost more to make contact with but there's a reason for that each will provide a random item of a specific level okay okay so i got level 10 shit includes weapons armor upgrade mods omni tool bio amps blah blah okay so it's just like a rant okay so i did get items and it just randomly went into my fucking stuff. Okay. Hmm. Guessing there was nothing that I needed, though. Oh, uh, eh, blue wire tool. I think I might have picked that one up though. Duelist X, that's something I didn't buy. Phoenix 9. Colossus 7. Predator. What am I wearing right now? Damage protection, but shields go up. That's good for me, so I can use the Predator stuff. It has an extra slot with it, so might as well. Might as well use that. Oops. Put it in the wrong slot. What did I have in my other slot? There we go. Alright. Well, that's Pinnacle Station. Guess we can do Bring Down the Sky now. There's that, and then there's like a third DLC, which I, I forgot what it was, not gonna lie. I might have done it already. Hope not. What the fuck is this anomaly? Piss me off. I don't know what it is. I want to check something on my phone real quick. Okay, the DLC is just bringing down the sky in Pinnacle Station. All right, cool. I just want to see what the fuck that anomaly is. I 
don't know what the fuck this is. Is this the story shit? I think it might be story shit. I just want to like double check that it's not like some random side quest that I didn't do. It might be it might be story shit i'm not sure it's weird maybe like the mods fucking with it or something I, I don't know maybe i'm not supposed to have access to that yet but uh let's do bring down the sky which introduces the Bertarians. the race that bioware put in and fucked up <laughs> because <laughs> because for some reason <coughs> in every instance that you meet a Batarian well I know there's only like one instance where like they're not a good guy but they're not a they're not 100% a bad guy anywhere most Batarians are just bad you just shoot them on sight whenever the option is shoot a Batarian or not just shoot him because either he's bad or he's about to do something bad Don't worry, ma'am. We're here to the rescue. We're gonna shut down the charges. Do the thing that you asked us to do. Save the world. What the hell is over here? Oh, I didn't mean to press that. There we go. Damn. That sucks. What the fuck, Tally? What are you wearing? Did I switch your armor, Tally? Squad? Tally, what's your equipment? I don't have anything for you, Tally. Oh, I guess I do. I need to give you some better guns. What are you good with? You're good with pistols and shotguns, right? Oh, look at that. And then Garrus, you're good with snipers and, uh... Hmm. You're good with snipers and assault. You're fine. You're fine, Garrus. You're fine. Papa Garrus, we love you. Oh my god, there's a lot of bullshit here. Oh, Christ. Transmission tower. Fusion torch. As long as we don't get rid of the last fusion torch, it doesn't activate anything, right? I think we should be good. It's okay, ma'am. We're we're fucking heroes. We're here to save you. Man, that turn stood no chance.
There we go. Where's the uh, last one? It's over there. Knock, knock. I'm here to deliver the chocolates. <gasps> Batarians! Shoot them on sight. Batarians. Oh my god. I said that with hatred. Wait, that's a sniper I'm using. I'm gonna use my assault. It's been a while. Ugh. Come on, team. Yeah, he <laughs> set his body on fire. Bad, Batarian. Bad. Come on, team. Let's go. God, I can't wait for Mass Effect 2. <laughs> but there's other games we must do beforehand. Even though I really want to do Mass Effect 2 next. Oh, I want to do it so bad. Uh, disable it. I got this with my science powers. Yes. I hear you. What's going on? Who are you? My name's Kate Bowman. I'm an engineer. I was part of the team assigned to bring this asteroid to Terra Nova. We were attacked yesterday by Batarian extremists. I've been hiding since they arrived. When aren't they extremists? I think they know the torch went out. Why are they doing this? I don't know. But if this asteroid Why are they doing this? They're Batarians. They're evil. Shoot them on sight. If I find out anything, I'll Good luck. Don't worry, ma'am. I'll save you. After I open this crate. Sponsored by Loot Crate. Apparently, that company's still fucking alive. I guess people never, like, canceled their Loot Crate subscriptions. Speaking of fucking getting packages and shit, I ordered something from fucking, uh, what's it called? Pixel Empire or whatever? I ordered something that a YouTuber was selling. I usually don't buy from YouTubers. But this one seemed of a pretty great value of entertainment, so I said, fuck it, why not? I like the YouTuber, I will support them. And got an email. Email's all like, alright, here's your shipping information. Click on it. There's no shipping information. What? <laughs> Who the fuck are you? Hey. Wow. Oh, God. I didn't mean to. Are you hurt? Don't worry about it. Uh. You can't go firing your weapon at everything that moves. What the hell's wrong with you? Sorry. I thought you were one of them. Here's a tip two eyes, human. Four eyes, Batarian. Yeah, okay. I'll remember that. I know you're scared, but I'm here to help. Commander Shepard, with the Alliance. Simon. Simon Atwell. I'm the chief engineer on this rock. Listen, we don't have much time. The Batarians fired up the fusion torches. You've got to shut them down before we hit Terra Nova. There are four million people down there, Shepard. I... My family. My kids! Aronis, Please, Shepard, I have children! Nice community. It's good schools. Batarians everywhere, and I need to shut down all three torches. Anything else I should know? One of the torches is surrounded by live blasting caps. We were set up to excavate when we arrived at Terra Nova. I rigged them with proximity detectors. That tank of yours will set them off, so you'll have to go in on foot. Even then, they'll explode if you get too close. Just go slow and easy. You should be fine. Hmm. You set them up. Can you disable them? Not from here. No. There are manual controls by the entrance to the torch facility inside the blast zone. You can disarm the caps there. One last thing. I had a crew working off-site when the attack hit. I'm worried about them. 
These Batarians are ruthless. I saw them smash the faceplates of guys working vacuum. And those Varen, I don't think they always wait for a corpse before feeding. All right, I'll do what I can. I'll look for them, but the torches have to be my priority. Yeah, you're right. Saving Terra Nova is more important than my team. There were a bunch of engineers over at the main facility, but they're probably all dead. That or being held hostage by the Batarians. Mm. A woman named Kate Bowman contacted me. The Batarians haven't found her yet. Katie's alive. She's one of my best engineers. She signed on with her brother, Aaron. I, I think his name is. He's no, security not obligatory joke okay. about a Aaron. All right. Whatever. Stay out of sight, dude. You'd better find a good place to hide. If the Batarians come back and find you. Yeah. I think I'll make myself scarce. Good luck, Shepard. Get the fuck out of here, dude. They're definitely gonna check this place. Alright. Check the map. Check in the map. I'm gonna have to head to every location, because once you're done with the Bring, bring Down the Sky DLC, you're definitely not coming back to this area. Of course you're going to be all the fuck the way up here. Why wouldn't you? <sighs> the hell is this? Uh, filled with Operation Longs, Personal Journal, Small Pirate, Music, Station, Operated... Okay. Put on some music. <laughs> Soothe my nerves. And away we go! I'm going the wrong way. Ah, shit. Perfect. Beautiful. I love how for this DLC area, they were like, let's not make this place have like a million mountains, because they realized, I mean, they should have been realized it before the game came out, but they were like, controlling the Normandy is a complete piece of shit. It's a pain, not the Normandy, my bad, the Mako. It's a complete piece of shit. So let's not, let's put mountains, right, but let's not make them all craggedy and shit. Because if you did that... It'd be a pain in the ass. I wish I can fucking change the change the way I was tilted so I don't do this shit. Come on, you got enough momentum to get up there. There you go. Oh, come on, you're right there. Heading out. Oh, look at that, a dead body. Damn, what you got here? Cool. Got some cool shit. Got loot. That's all that matters. Um, I'm right here. Might as well go for it. I'm trying to remember what the fuck I was saying before the dude uh, cut me off. Oh yeah, 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 I was talking about fucking Pixel Empire, where the fuck. Uh, yeah. So basically, bought something from from my YouTuber. Oh my god, why do I keep getting cut off when I'm talking about this shit? Sorry, there's a lot of feedback. See if I can fix it. Meantime, just keep doing. I'm, I'm doing good, girl, and it's alright. I got this. Don't worry. I'm Shepard. I got it all under control. Anyways, awesome shit from Pixel Empire. Basically, 
They send out the shipping information. Shipping information had nothing on it. And I was like, huh? That's weird. And then, like, right on cue, I got a random text by some fucking... Which I assume is a scam-ass, scam-ass number. Right? And it was like, oh, uh, UPS doesn't have your, uh... Your, uh, shipment information. Number is like, four, four, five, six, seven, three... Like, a bunch of numbers. Like, way more than any number should actually be. Right? And also, I'm pretty sure UPS doesn't fucking text you unless you explicitly tell them to or something. But... It's like, oh, uh, yeah, so, uh, so, uh, just make sure you click this link over here. And I looked at the message, and I'm like, first of all, even if there was a link, I'm not clicking shit. Second of all, there is no link. You just sent a fucking, like, web page. Third of all, I was like, all right, what if I type that into Google? Type it into Google. Fucking, the thing doesn't exist. And I'm like, what, what was the point? You're not scamming me. You're just wasting my time. Like, I'm assuming it's like some bot that never got deactivated or some shit. I thought I had a shotgun. I thought I had a shotgun. That's why I just ran up on the dude like that. I mean, they can't stop me. I'm pretty sure that was Tally that blew that up and incinerated that guy. Yeah, get him, Garrus. Heart's in the right place, Garrus. I, I see what you're trying to do. I'm proud of you. You make me proud. Keep keep shooting, Garrus. Yeah, but I'm just like, what the fuck was the point of this stupid message? <laughs> also, very weird that it came that it came like around the same time I got like that fucking stupid email from Pixel Empire. I'm gonna check that email after the stream, by the way, see if that shipment information updated by itself because it should have. Never bought anything from Pixel Empire before. Usually, people say, like, it takes them, like, a while to send shit. I'm assuming it's probably, like, whatever you're buying is probably coming directly from, like, the home of the, of the person that's selling it or something. Are you there? You've got to hurry. You really pissed them off. Their leader's setting charges everywhere. I think he's going to blow this whole facility. Get away from there! Don't shoot, please! No! <sighs> You can tell he's the boss because he's a green batarian. Who's shutting down the torches? I won't ask him again. Girl, just tell him. I'm already shooting them down. That guy died for nothing. Find this problem and deal with it. Get her out of here! You keeping quiet served zero benefit. Who's shutting down the torches? You could have just said... Could have just said, like, reinforcements. You could have just said that, because, I mean, that that's pretty... You don't even know who the fuck I am. You could have... There was zero information you could have given them whether you spoke or not. But at least saying something would have had a higher chance of keeping that dude alive. He had no that guy had no reason to die. He died for nothing. His death was in vain. That was like a really dumb choice on your part, lady. Why didn't Shepard just speak up as well? Why can't I do that? Why can't I just be like, it's me. What's up? I'm Shepard. Hi. How you doing? Did you notice that the evil race of Bertarian rhymes with Barbarian? I'm not saying it's coincidence, but you know, I'm just saying, you know what I'm saying? You know, they're all into, like, pillaging and being pirates and doing slavery. 
I'm just saying, you know, a little on the nose there. Oh look, there's mines! I should be very careful of those. I should be very careful. It's a minefield. I should go very slowly. Was that all? Was that all of them? It's a minefield. I should be very careful when I go over here. Ground penetrating radar detects anti-vehicle demolitions nearby. That's cool. Why are you going the other way? I want you to go that away. No. I want you to go that way. No. Turn around. I want you to go that way. Why? Mm -hmm. Why are you making it more difficult than it needs to be? Damn it, can you just fly over there for me, please? Thank you. We'll be there soon. I made a little bit of distance, maybe. I'm not sure. Doesn't seem like it. I think I went backwards again. I went backwards. Penetrating radar detects anti-vehicle demolitions nearby. Proceed on foot. <sighs> oh my god. I just wanna fly over there all cool like, but you won't let me. Warning. Ground penetrating radar detects anti-vehicle demolitions nearby. Proceed on foot. Man. Fuck your minds. I do what I want. Oh fuck. Really? They just like off you like that? Damn. <laughs> Not even like a chance? Did the mines get me in midair, by the way? Is that what just happened? Did I get blown up by mines in midair? Oh, you're gonna land directly in there. Ground penetrating radar detects anti-vehicle demolitions nearby. Proceed on foot. You said proceed on foot? Oh really? Wait, so even if I try to <laughs> Wait. Ground penetrating radar detects anti-vehicle demolitions nearby. Proceed on foot. Ground penetrating radar. So if I flew over it. I would still get blown up. Really? It's kind of stupid. Let's test that theory. I like being stupid. I like doing stupid things. Ground penetrating radar detects anti vehicle demolitions nearby. Damn it. Proceed on. Trying to have fun with it. Come on, fly over there. Stop going to the side. I'm gonna try it one more time. If not, then I'll just fucking go on foot. Oh my god, go the other way. Alright, whatever. It's just gonna automatically blow me up. Okay. <laughs> I thought I could, like, fly over it. Do a halo drop. <laughs> the first ever halo drop. In space. Alright, let's do it the boring way. Oh, come on, get up there. Let's do it on foot. Walk past the mines. It'll be all boring and shit. 
not having any fun in my video game. That's okay. Sitting on foot. Come on, let's go. Stupid ass. Fucking stupid, dumb bullshit. Uh huh. Going slow. It's all right. It's all right, team. We got this. It's all right. It's all right. Just take out the sniper and deal with the jackasses. Wait, is it a turret or are we getting shot at? I think we're getting shot at. Fucking, uh, hey, yo, like, Garrison, what's your face? Go. I kinda wanna see you guys get blown up, I'm not gonna lie, that's why I'm sending you out there like that. Really? You just eat a fucking headshot like that? I'm back. Oh, that's my shotgun. Oh my. Right. Now, who would like to get shot first? Release the Baron. Ow. <laughs> Just bopping on the schnoz. Oh my god, I can't wait to get to Mass Effect 2. I'm gonna be meleeing the shit out of everything. It's all red and evil and glowy. We're evil. I like the shade Over of red. Right there. This doesn't have to end in bloodshed. Yeah, it does. What do you want? Don't come any closer. What's up? We can do this the hard way, or we can end this peacefully. I wish we can do it peacefully. But literally, every Britarian that you run into in every Mass Effect game is bad in one way or another. So just shoot these fuckers on sight. I've got nothing to say to a Batarian terrorist. Look, I'm just doing my job here. Hijacking this rock wasn't my idea. I signed on to make a little profit. A quick slave grab, nothing more. Quick slave grab. That's reason enough for me. Yeah, there we go. Damn it. Get him! No one leaves! Hey man, I just want to leave with a couple of slaves. 
why the hell would I let you go? What makes you think I would just let your dumb ass do that, huh? Huh? How smart? Wow, Tally. You just bopped him in the head like it was... <laughs> I was gonna kick him around a little bit, but you just... Alright. No. Bad. Oh, I missed. You really stood no chance there. Alright, you two, chill the fuck out. I was right there, you didn't have to blow me up. Jesus. You found a, a key card to the main installation, Lieutenant. Okay, whatever. Hey man, I just wanted to grab a couple of slaves, alright? Like, what? No. What are you, stupid? You think I'm gonna... You think I'm just gonna say yeah? Oh, a couple of slaves, man. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> the fuck? Check out this anomaly over here, which is basically... I believe it's the last crew member. Should be. Oh, come on, come on, get, get that... Ah, oh, damn it. Fuel tank, I had to shoot it. Hello, explosives move for safety. That's a fun song. <laughs> Just walk in there, music's playing. Alright. The main facility. Let's get our asses over there. Let's get over there. Shoot a couple of Batarians. Save the world. You know. Spectre shit. There we go, there's a bunch of fucking turns over there. Turns are fun. I didn't think about it, I should have brought Ashley with me. I bet she would have said some fun shit. Ooh, level up. I bet Ashley would have been, like, super racist. Like, we get to shoot aliens? Yeah! Oh no, these turrets are deadly because they move into cover. However, will I defeat them? Wow, that was great. That was great. That was, that was a... Amazing plan. I almost pressed the return Normandy button. That would have been that would have been terrible. I would have to drive my ass all the way over here again. Um, hmm. Electronics charm. There's really no reason for charm anymore. I mean, oh, my Paragon's actually pretty all right. 
But it looks like I'm gonna get I'm gonna get just a little bit a little bit of renegade down there. What do you got for me, Garrison? Uh, hmm. Increase your shield capacity. Dally, you've been using your pistol a lot, which is pretty good. But I'm gonna up your electronics. I'm holding on to my points. We don't have any like new crazy quit. I just want to see if we picked up any armor. That's just all I want right now. I just want the colossal armor. All he has is the one for uh oh light armor for Terran. Did I not Garrus? Garrus, did I really not give you that? Look all nice and hot. Sexy. What do you got? What are you wearing? You're wearing a Phoenix. Okay. Oh shit. Well, if my shit's gonna overheat like that, might as well just use the damn shotgun. What's up, loser? Oh my god, I just blasted that guy into fucking space dust. Sometimes my gun just doesn't want to shoot. I think, oh, I know what it is. I keep moving my fucking mouse by accident. Wait, that's Garrus, I'm sorry. <laughs> Garrus is like, am I a Batarian? Two eyes, four eyes, remember? Remember, Shepard? Blasting the fools away. Like it ain't none of my goddamn business. Do it all the way over here. Where's he at the bottom? Yeah. Explody. Die. <laughs> Die, human. <laughs> to blow yeah, him up. Human. Yeah, what's up? What's up, Blanca? You're almost more trouble than you're worth. Hmm. I'm just getting started. Predictable, but this is over. I'm leaving this asteroid. If you try to stop me, I'll detonate these charges, and your helper and her friends are all going to die. Hmm. Not that easy. Can't let you do that stuff, Fox. You don't get to leave, Valak. Not after what you've done. What I've done? This is nothing compared to what's been done to the Batarians. We've been forced into exile. Forced to survive on what we can scrounge up. It's been like that for decades. You're fucking slavers, dude. And pirates. And when you read their backstory, I think... They had their own weird little Batarian war thing going on. You guys are assholes. It's your damn fault. Don't make it sound like you're the innocent party here. You brought it upon yourselves. Really? You invaded our space, took our resources, and when we asked the Council for aid, they brushed us off. We were left to defend ourselves, but the humans were stronger than us. We knew that. The Council knew that. But it didn't matter. It was you. You and your kind are the only reason we're in this position. How does killing innocent people make up for that? We had no other options. Sometimes you need to get someone's attention before they listen. That's why we attacked you at Elysium. That's why I'm doing this. You forced our hand. You attacked us first. When we retaliated, you ran off to the council hoping for help. When you didn't get it, you hid. 
You've got no one to blame but yourselves. Enough! You couldn't possibly understand. Actually, you just don't want to understand, and I'm done wasting my breath. Pretty much. Now, I want to shoot you. If you want your friends to live, I suggest you step aside. Son of a bitch. Mm. Mm. I think Chad Wellington would make the right call here. He would save the hostages first. But I just really want to shoot the guy. I'm not letting a terrorist like you go free. Do what you want with the others, but it'll be the last thing you do. I hope this is worth it. Sorry, people. I'm going to enjoy gunning you. I'm not letting your bitch ass get away. Nah. -uh. Sup, loser? Where do you go? You're no better than us. I gave you a chance to save them and you threw it away. <laughs> Who's the real terrorist here? You. But you're dead. Is it safe? You're standing in the open. You haven't been shot. What do you think? I... There might have been something I could have done to help. I thought I should be here. I know this asteroid better than anyone. You did it. Another hour in our I think I was supposed to return to the guy to fucking like tell him that his people were all right or some shit. would have struck near the capital city, the most densely populated region. But that's not going to happen, thanks to you. Have you found Katie and her team? Hmm. Balak murdered Katie and the others. Blew them up with a bomb. All of them? Katie? And her brother? Everyone? How could this happen? I thought you were... Couldn't you save them? In my offense... My offense... In my defense... I will say... If I let him go... There was a chance that he would pull this shit again, right? There was a chance, but I'm pretty sure if you if you let him go, it wasn't really it wouldn't really be a big deal in Mass Effect Three or whatever or something like that. So, anyways, yes, I could have if I let the Batarians go, but then they might have done the same thing to another colony, or two more, or a dozen. That doesn't. I know in my head what you're saying makes sense. It's just a little hard to see the big picture right now, all right? Shepard, thank you for my grandchildren's lives. I don't think I'll stick around, though. Not with the team gone. Too many ghosts. It's time for me to get back and spend some time with my family. Before I go, I'd like to offer you something. Maybe you'll have more use for it than I will. Oh? Uh -huh. engineer, I get some quality items. Take your pick. You've earned it. Human light armor. Human medium armor. Heavy human armor. And me the Omni Tool. I don't need your Omni Tool. Give me the quarry armor. You have quarry and armor? That's hard to come by. We hired a few to help install the torches. They really knew their stuff. You're welcome to take it. One more thing. You asked me to look into your missing engineers. Have you found them? Hmm. Uh. Just one so far? Wait, I thought I found them already. I thought I found all of them. I came across a member of your crew. He didn't make it. 
I see. Well, maybe the other two are still out there. Would you mind looking? Take care of yourself. Be well, Shepard. We owe you. I'm not sure if the Quarian armor was like a good one. Or not. I think his Omni tool might be the best Omni tool you can get. I'm not sure. Oh, it's Colossus Axe. Oh yeah, it was definitely good. Look at Tally looking all fucking beautiful and shit. Oh my god. I want to play Mass Effect 2 right now. God damn. Alright, what the hell is this? Oh. Yeah, this is where I could have saved them. Nice. Uh, you guys are uh, you guys are pretty fucking dead. Sorry about that. Sorry, couldn't really do much. Not my fault. Definitely wasn't going to let that guy go. Definitely was going to put it into that guy. Right then and there. Where's my renegade points? Renegade. Ah. Renegade. Get a raid. I think if I save them, one of them would like give us an item or some shit. Maybe? I'm not sure. I don't know. I don't remember. How the fuck do I get out of here? Oh, it's this way. Wait, is it this way? Fuck. I thought this only led upstairs. Prison cell. Okay, I don't know why it's telling me about the hostages, but they're dead. They're not hostages anymore. They're fucking corpse. That's what they are. How the fuck do I get out of here? I, I don't know how to get out of here. I'm basically stuck. Where the fuck is the exit? I'm gonna lose my goddamn mind. That's the upper level. Okay, this is the exit. Or the entrance. Whatever the fuck. Oh my god. Give me a fucking panic attack. Oh wait, no, it's on the bottom. What am I doing? Why am I going up? Get me the hell out of here. Oh, can you tell me where to find your homeboys? Say, Shepard. You didn't happen to find any. Not yet. Can you See think if you can anything? tap into our transmission tower out on the surface. Their equipment sheds will show up on your sensors. Take care of yourself. Be well, Shepard. I thought I checked it already. Did I not check it already? Radio station? Construction site? Explosive cache? Did I just not look at the bodies hard enough? What the fuck? You know, fuck you, fuck you, and fuck your goddamn team. They're dead. They're all dead. They don't answer you or walk back. They're dead.
You go look for them your damn self. I did what I had to. Alright, how long have we been doing this for? What time is it? Hmm. Well, we did get some colossal armor. Let's let's head downstairs real quick. I don't think there's nothing we can do with the crewmates, right? I don't think I don't think there's any progression towards Ashley. Hey Ashley, you got anything new to say? Probably not. Commander. All right. We'll talk later, Williamson. Looking forward to it, Skipper. Okay, what did I want to do down here? I want to talk to you. Looking for supplies? Yep. You got anything good? Let's see what you've got. You bet, Commander. You bet, Commander. Of course. Anything for you. Oh come on, motherfucker! Really, you don't got anything? Damn it. Alright, well, shit. I think there's like a couple of cleanup things I can do. Right? I know there's like a couple of like... Planets with some like research facilities on them and shit that I haven't checked out, but I don't think there's anything like really big or anything like that. Any big missions. Just like little skirmishes here and there. Things that... Things that you can just kind of easily find by just checking the area out. Uh, yeah, no. Ugh, finding these fucking engineers. Oh my god, I'm definitely not going to do that on stream. Because any more time the Mako, I'm going to fucking shoot myself. <laughs> can I say that? Am I allowed to? Will I get demonetized? Will I get cancelled? I still know what the fuck this is pissing me off. I think it might be where, uh, where we need to go or whatever. I don't know. What the fuck is this anomaly over here? What's this? What anomaly is this? What the hell is this? Taking Ashley with me. I'm taking Ashley and I'm taking. Taking Tally. I don't really hang out with Ashley and Tally that much, do I? That boy kind of dead. Alright, what the hell is on this planet? Oh shit, I haven't been here before? Then what the fuck is this? A listening post? Anomaly. Let's just head to the listening post. Everything else is just kind of, you know, there. Oh, wait, is there a thresher mall on this planet? Nope. These are my favorite planets. The ones with very few bumps. Cause it's it's a pretty smooth ride. Might as well check out this anomaly. What the hell is this? A probe? We probing out here? A oh, sorry capsule. Or capsule. Capsule. People pronounce things weird, okay? Cool. Might as well do it, get some money, right? The hell was that noise? Why was it so loud, like directly in my ear? The fuck is this? Oh, it's Rachni. Yeah, we gotta we gotta clear this out. That's for damn sure. Start eliminating these Rachni. Rachni, Rachni. Is 
that it? We good? We good? We done? We did it? Nice. I'm assuming there will be more in here. Team guns up. Oh man, that dude dead. Might as well just like clear out with little anomalies we have on like our scanners. Fucking rack night babies. The hell? Oh, it was a death cry. That shit was like directly in my ear. Kinda of scary, not gonna lie. I don't like bugs. They're gross. They're gross and squishy. And they're squishy in the squishy places that shouldn't be squishy, and they're hard in the hard places that shouldn't be hard. What the hell is that? The noise coming from these things? The fuck are those? Oh my god, that noise is like right in my fucking ear. According to this, they received a supply ship just two days ago. The Rachni must have attacked since then. Hmm. Where'd that supply ship come from? One moment. These things are drones, dispatched at irregular intervals from different depots to reduce the likelihood of tracking. I have it. This one came from Argos Row. Let's get this over with. Somebody needs an ass kicking. Whoever it is, we'll find them there. Aye, aye, Commander. <laughs> Ashley's like, oh, we gotta kill aliens? Hell yeah. What the fuck, didn't I? Mayday! 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 This is Lieutenant Marie Durand, 314th Infantry, Alliance 10th Frontier Division. The listening post has been overrun by unidentified hostile life forms. Request immediate extraction. Alright, well, let's check the other room then. Gotta be some information in there. I opened the door and I started blasting! You guys really got it bad. What the fuck are these mines? What, what are these damn things? Alright team, let's go. We're definitely gonna get ambushed on the way out though. Not ambushed. Surprised. <coughs> Alright. Well, uh... Still has the plot point on it. Don't think I missed anything of note in there, though. We have our objective, which is go check out the other fucking area. Listing post alpha. Wait, what? What the hell is this? You two are coming with. gonna check the area out real quick see what the fuck anomaly anomaly oh uh, rack die hives okay well I'm not gonna do this shit on stream right it's just kind of menial task here and there I don't think there's any like big story 
quests or like big side quests left anymore. We pretty much did the bulk of it, right? There's definitely like little instances here and there that's left that I'm going to do on my own time, clean it up so we can just, you know, get the benefit of, uh, of fully wrapping up the game. I would show it all off, but you know, fucking, I'm pretty sure nobody really wants to watch it that badly. Me driving around the Mako and doing needless shit, right? So next time we come on Mass Effect over here, we're going to call this a part, actually, we're going to call this a session. Next time on Mass Effect, right? Uh, we're going to make our way toward, if there's nothing, oops, hit my microphone stand. If there's nothing else major to do, right, in terms of side quests or DLC or fucking main quest or whatever, which I don't think there is, right? Um, we're going to go make our way to fucking Ilos, and then after that, we should be ready to finish the game. So the next, next stream would be, uh, us finishing the game, basically, and that stream should be happening, happening, can't speak, should be happening tonight, around the same time, right? So, today, I'm gonna go around, finish up the stuff, grab whatever equipment I can grab for the team, right? Just, to uh, have a sense of completion, and then, and then, uh, when we join back up here, later tonight, we're gonna be heading to Ilos and finishing up the game and stuff like that, so... I hope you guys enjoyed the stream. I enjoyed doing it. Pinnacle Station, doing it for the first time. That was pretty fun. Um, it was pretty fun, but I think next time we get a DLC like that, as if the reward isn't really that great, then I'm just going to like not really worry about it too much, you know? Um, and then after that, uh, bring down the sky. That, that DLC went faster than I thought it would be, honestly. <laughs> and then, uh, what else is there I want to say? No, that's pretty much just Pretty much it. Everything I want to say. Forgot that you get the colossal armor for for uh, Tally. I was about to call her for Quarry, <laughs> for Tally. Uh, if you guy, if you ask the guy for that. But um, yeah, that's pretty much everything I want to say about Mass Effect right now. Uh, over at the YouTube channel, I'm not sure if I'm going to be uploading things today or not. Because right now I'm just kind of going on an editing spree and just finishing up editing videos that I had sitting in the back burner that I need to finish like kind of just doing it in bulk and then when I start uploading I kind of just want to upload them in bulk so at some point a lot of videos are just going to get uploaded all at once and it's going to seem like a lot and it is going to be a lot but I just kind of want to clear them up and kind of start start at like a new pace right get all of it off my plate so we can move on to more stuff right that includes the uh Resident Evil 5 stuff, the uh, Zelda Breath of the Wild stuff, uh, the stuff for the Pokemon Marathon, and uh, and even the uh, Spider-Man Miles Morales streams and the uh, Borderlands 1 co-op streams that we did, right? And then hopefully once all that gets uploaded, we can move over to new stuff, right? And, you know, kind of have it feel, have a sense of completion there on the YouTube channel as well, right? So... Link to my YouTube channel. It's on my uh, it's on my bios or whatever or my Twitch page. You know, it's there, right? Uh, what else is there? Oh yeah, also Twitter. I try to be active on it, but sometimes you just open Twitter and it gives you a headache. But hey, I'm active on Twitter, right? If you ever got any like fan fan shit, <laughs> fan shit. If you got any fucking, I can't speak. I'm kind of tired. If you got any like fan art or anything you want to send my way, do it through Twitter. Right, you can at me, you know, Firestorm0 underscore zero. It's the same thing as everything else, pretty much, unless told otherwise, right? So, there's that. Follow me over at Twitter. I get close to, like, I get close to having, like, 100 followers, but then, like, by the time I get to, like, 97, for some reason, like, fi like it's, like, every single time, it's, like, you're at 98, 99. Oh, look at that, you lost five followers. Like, what? Why? <laughs> Why do you guys just don't like me seeing, why do you like me seeing get numbers, you know, you don't want to see me get those numbers, right? But, um, yeah, you know, support the YouTube, follow me at Twitter, blah, 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 all that other bullshit, check out the stuff on YouTube, Twitch streams will be going up on YouTube, as for the LA Noir stuff, I think we're just gonna go hush hush on that because... I do want to upload it on YouTube, but at the end of the day, there's like one session that I just didn't grab in time, so that's gone to the ether, and I feel like if I just upload it 
We never finished that playthrough, right? But I feel like if I uploaded whatever we have, it would just feel incomplete, and I don't want to do that. So, um, yeah. That, those streams will be a treat for the people who showed up for those streams, right? Now, what else is there? Nope, that's everything I want to say. That's everything I want to say, right? You know, all the, all the Steam stuff, as always, right? So, as always, I want to say thank you guys for watching. And hopefully, I'll see you in the next video, next stream, whatever. And... Once again, as always, stay happy, stay healthy, and take care.